What's going on, guys? <clears throat> Excuse me. The voice may be a little bit raspy here, guys. Just waking up. It's pretty early in the morning. What's happening, guys? What is happening? Just let me finish getting all settled in here. Oh, let's stretch it out. Let's let's get into this, guys. How are we in the chat? Looks like we got Lucario 54. We got Pokemon Daily. Uh, Nicholas Davage. We've got uh, Pokemon Slayer. What's up? How was your day? It's actually, fun fact, it is actually a uh, quarter to ten in the morning right now. I woke up about an hour, roughly an hour ago, so it's pretty early in the morning. So my day so far, it's been pretty good. I woke up on the uh, the right side of the, be the bed, I guess you could say. I'm spending the night with a friend, and uh, what, what, where's the where's the end of it, Andrea? But uh, let's uh, let's get cracking into some packs, guys. It, yeah, it is pretty early in the morning right now. I just want to crack into some um, some sun and moon packs. I was kind of feeling the vibes last night. I was getting I was getting addicted uh, to playing this dark ray deck as well. So I thought, why not? Um, I'll, I'll just get up early in the morning. I'll just stream it with you guys. Why not? It's 4:44. Yeah. So for a lot of uh, a lot of the US viewers right now, it should be uh, mid to late afternoon. So it should be a pretty good time to uh, stream for you guys. But let's go. Let's go to the Sun and Moon packs here, and let's start cracking into some packs straight away without like any hesitation at all. Let's just go. Let's get, just get cracking. See if we can get a, a uh, secret rare Ultra Ball out of this Sun and Moon base pack, which I just can't seem to get ever. It's 6.45 for me. Whereabouts uh, Whereabouts is that? Is that AM or PM, uh, Nicholas? Have you had time to see one of my videos yet? I remembered after the stream, Lucario54, but I couldn't remember your username to go back and like check out your channel. I remember going, oh, whose channel did I have to check check out? And I just could not remember. So I'll, um, give me, give me a moment. I'll take, I'll, I'll grab out my handy dandy notepad. Give me half a second, guys. Let's Go. grab it. Let's grab out the uh, notepad. Yo, thank you, thank you, Pokemon Five S for the subscription. Thanks for su subscribing to the channel. You guys will hear whenever someone subscribes to the channel. You guys will hear uh, hear a little derp, a little derp, derp. Five forty-five p.m. Where you are? Yeah, guys, let me know in the chat what time it is for you, um, for you guys right now but let's uh let's grab the handy dandy notepad let's go lucario 54 okay there we go hey brody i'm watching all the way from scotland wow <laughs> that's ages that's ages away samantha shout out to you all the way from scotland how's it like what's the weather like in scotland samantha Alrighty, so we just got a Decidueye. How is everything, guys? As well, on the like, is uh, everything everything's looking looking good, sounding good? The music's not too too loud. Well, let's um, let's go to the chat box here, and let me give me a sec, guys. I'm just gonna tweak tweak the chat box real quick. I want the uh, I want the notifications just to stay up for a little bit longer. I was kind of playing with it off stream. For a little bit here, but let's go to here. Let's hide the messages after. Let's go like something like that. Let's see how that goes. Okay, so let's go something like that, I think. And let's make it a little bit bigger maybe let's get the chat just a little bit bigger so I can show a bit of love to you guys on the stream here just give me a sec while we do some some tweaking let's go something like that let's see see if that um, that adjusts live and we can uh, see what's going on here something like that we'll see how that goes <clears throat> <clears throat> okay. Hey Carlos, welcome to the stream. <laughs> Christopher James, you're, you're my biggest fan. I'm I'm glad that you are you enjoy the channel. I'm flattered. 
I'm flattered by everyone that, that just enjoys the channel. You guys are the best. Okay, so let's just keep cracking into... I'll keep an eye on the chat and see what you guys are saying, but I'm just going to get to work here. I'm going to keep this stream pretty productive today. Uh, I'll, I'll interact with you guys as we go, but I'm just going to try and keep it... We're going to keep it keep it straight to business today. But there we go, straight off the bat, we've got a Lunala GX. It's got uh, 250 HP with the ability Psychic Transfer, Moon Guys Beam, and Lunafall GX. And I was first seeing a deck. What, what deck was it last night that had this Lunala? I think it was a Lunala Mewtwo combo. Because of that ability, it says as often as you like, uh, during your turn, before you attack, you may move a Psychic Energy from one of your Pokemon to another of your Pokemon. So you can kind of set up a Mewtwo using Psychic Transfer. So that's kind of wild. That's a, that's a pretty solid card. But yeah, I was versing a Mewtwo deck that had Lunala, Lunala in it. It was pretty good. <laughs> I'm your second biggest fan. <laughs> How can, how can you like rank yourself when it comes to being like the fan of someone's channel? What, what would that mean? I'm like, I'm like the millionth fan of Unlisted Leaf. And there we go, going back to back here. We're within reason, I think we had like a pack gap there between full arts. We got a Lapras GX full art. It's got 190 HP people collect Blizzard Burn and Ice Beam GX. I was actually going to make a Lapras deck last night for the stream today as well, just to muck around with it and kind of, kind of play play on stream with you guys. So that's nice. That's nice to have in the uh, in the collection here. Brody, watch this snap again. Um, all the links to the socials is in the description. I think I can I can post it for you guys. Just in here. Just give me half a second. Let's go like this. Something like that. That's some that's some of the links there. Alrighty. So let's go into the into the next pack here. Yeah, the full art is going off right now, Train Kid 1000. Please shout me out. Shout out to EF Nation. Welcome to the stream. Thanks for coming and hanging out with the fam. Alrighty guys, we got a powerful 28 viewers right now. That's popping guys. Welcome. Welcome to the stream, everyone. Thanks for coming and hanging out with me this morning on this fine Saturday morning. Is it Saturday? It's Sunday for me right now, but it's Saturday for a lot of you guys. Fun fact, it is actually the 28th of January at 10 o'clock in the morning on Sunday. But we got an Incineroar GX. It's got 250 HP with Hustling Strike, Tiger Swing, and Burning Slam GX. Not bad. Not bad. Bless Brody with the good luck. Yeah, I need all of the good luck. Send it all my way and go on back to back. There's a true back to back with the Umbreon GX. It's got 200 HP with Strafe, Shadow Bullet, and Dark Core GX. Just making sure everything is going well. It looks like everything is running smoothly. When Brody won't answer you, what's popping? <laughs> what's popping, uh, Potato Slayer? I try to. I try to. Uh, to get back to everyone in the chat as much as I can, but sometimes I'll skip over bits and pieces while I'm multitasking. Uh, for those guys who don't know me all that well, your boy is not the best at multitasking, so streaming is probably, it, it's a bit of a challenge for me personally, if I'm being 100% honest with you guys right now. So I'm try, I'm doing my best. I'll try to get back to everyone in the chat. If I do miss, you, miss your message in the chat, don't be offended, don't be upset. It's just, I, I just, I, I missed it. And I'll, uh, I'll keep an eye on the chat as much as I can while I'm cracking into some packs here. Do you like the new GX cards or are you up more for the EX cards? Uh, see, see, I, I'm a bit of a lover of the of the EX cards, but I do like the the input of the GX abilities. But that's nice. So we got an Aronga reverse reverse holo there. I don't think I've ever pulled an Aronguru Hollow, just the regular Hollow. But yeah, I'm, I'm a big fan of the uh, GXs, so they're, they're starting to grow on me. So uh, I might say GXs over EXs purely just because of the yeah the input of the GX attack there. Definitely throw like gets you thinking a lot more when playing playing the game online. But yeah, we got Solgaleo GX full art here. 
It's got uh, the ability Ultra Road, Sunsteel Strike, and Soul Burst. Yeah, so you can see this getting a bit more play uh, when Ultra Prism makes its way into rotation with that uh, metal buff there. But yeah, that's kind of wild. We got another full art there from Sun and Moon Base. It's about time Sun and Moon Base showed me some love. Is it okay for you to open up a black and white pack? No, I'm, I'm not going to open up any, any of those in the stream. Maybe later on, I might do some right at the end of the stream. For those guys that hang around all the way through to the end, we'll spice things up and throw it back a little bit. Hi Brody, I just joined the stream. Welcome to the stream, Luis Santos. Thanks for coming and hanging out. I know you enjoy, enjoy chilling, chilling in the stream. I like how you didn't even say anything when you pulled the Solgaleo. Yeah, yeah, I'm kind of just chilling right now. Right right now, it's like 10 o'clock in the morning. I've been up for like an hour. <laughs> We're just here chilling, killing. The Solgaleo is, is a good card, don't get me wrong, but right now it's not like, it, it's not the the big thing. There we go, another pre, we got a Pre-Marina GX. The card that would get me going wild right now would be the Ultra Ball Secret Rare. I, I've never pulled it in real life. I need it for the set binder, but then here on TC, TCGO, I haven't pulled it either, so it needs to be a thing. And when I get it, then you'll see me. It might it might be the uh, the kickstart to get me um, get me hyped for today's stream. We're kind of, yeah, at the moment, it's just chill chat, cracking some packs. It's all good times. Brody, can you open up some Pop 5 packs? See, I've... I've wanted to open up some Pop Series 5 packs to, to do a bit of a Umbreon, is it Umbreon Espeon Gold Star Hunt? But those packs are so expensive. I just haven't been able to find the time to... <laughs> oh, I'll not really find the time. It's more like just put money aside to dedicate to Pop 5. But there's another Umbreon GX. Not too bad. That's my third one here on TCGO. And two of those we've got from today's stream as well. So we nearly get a full play set of Umbreons going here. Not too bad. Hi Brody, when are you doing, uh, when you're doing your way for some new cards, please. Okay, thank you. That, that's, that's confusing to read, Pokemon Daily, English. I, I need English <laughs> to, to read in the chat so I can respond to you. Uh, I just started watching the live stream. Welcome to the stream, Scyther Gaming. We're here, we're just chilling, we're crack cracking into, into some packs, and then later on we're gonna, we're gonna, uh, show off and like feature this guzzle dark ride uh, deck that i was playing with last night that was pretty fun it was definitely pretty fun it's a little bit of a trolley deck you can um you can do some major damage with guzzlord I, I never realized how like insanely powerful the guzzlord gx ability um gx attack is it's kind of wild i can't even remember what it's called off the top of my head right now but yeah it's pretty powerful but yeah, if you guys are new to the channel or like new watching the stream, you guys have not already subscribed, be sure to, to click that subscribe button just below the just below the stream. And you guys will hear a derp. Every single time someone subscribes, it'll just be like derp, derp. But we've got a reverse holo rare of a crocodile. And then we've got what do we have here? Just that that um, really vicious looking Bruxish. I'm not a big fan of that art by any means of that Bruxish. Is Australia getting Ultra Prism next week? Uh, so yesterday was actually the first day of pre-releases here on, in Australia. I didn't actually go because I went to the one in the US. So I was pretty satisfied with my pre-release there. And now I'm basically just putting money aside and saving saving all my money for the next, like, for my case. And just packs, packs on packs, stacks of packs of Ultra Prism. So yeah, Australia should be getting Ultra Prism any like any moment next week. Yeah, probably mid to late next week for sure. But we got a Lorantis GX full art. This is actually a pretty solid pull right here. I've got this is my second one here on TCGO, but it's uh, got 210 HP with Flower Supply, Solar Blade, and Chlorosite GX. This card was actually pretty playable when Sun and Moon Base actually came into like rotation when when it first came out. It was a pretty heavily desired card at one stage, so that's not too bad. I could make a grass deck work with that, I'm pretty sure. Definitely, with a bit of trial and error. You guys already know how it is. We've got another Oronguru. That's kind of wild. i got five reverse holo Orongarus, but I, I don't think I have a single holo, which is kind of wild. 
I should totally trade, see if there's any trades going for like reverse hollows for <laughs> reverse holo orongaroos for holo orongaroos. Are you doing a giveaway? Yeah, I am. Another what? Another Lorenzo's GX full art? Are you are you like are you for real right now? Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. That's a win, guys. <laughs> That's crazy. What are the what are the chances of that right now? What other chances of that? So, um, Game Night Nine says, are, "Are you doing a giveaway?" Yes, I am. The giveaway actually ends on February fourth, and uh, it's all decided by you guys as to what the prize is. So, if you guys have not been showing your support on the videos and dropping likes, the likes on the video decides the prize. So, if we if we don't hit 150, it's well. If it's 50, it's a blister pack. 150 is an elite trainer box. 300 is a booster box, and 600 is one of everything uh, to one lucky viewer. So. The likes is the big thing. The likes and the like and the comment for sure are the biggest things in the giveaway. But yeah, that's crazy. Lorantis GX full art. Have I pulled that Lorantis in real life? That's a good question. I don't think I have, to be honest. I think it's one of the the very few full arts that I need from Sun Moon Base. I don't think I've actually pulled it, and I have three of them here on TCGO. I don't know how that works, but yeah. It's broken. The pull rates here on TCGO is wild. Oh my goodness. We've got the Lunala GX Hyper Rare. Okay. Alright, I see you. I see you. Oh man. Give me a sec, guys. Before we see what's inside of this pack, I'm just going to turn the fan on. It's, it's pretty hot here in Australia right now. So let's go and turn this on. Okay, that should be a bit more, a bit better. So we can keep keep things going here. So yeah, we got the Rainbow Rare Lunala GX. That's kind of wild. That is kind of kind of wild. Just after getting the full art as well. I think that is the very first one that I have of the Lunala GX Hyper Rare as well. What video are you going to get the likes for the giveaway? So basically, how it works is it. I've kind of explained this like a, a lot of times now, but. Basically, it's any video that is uploaded. I say it in the intro. It's from any video that is uploaded from January 1st to February 4th. So it could be any one of those videos. I think I'm gonna. I'm not gonna include the live streams in particular. Uh, I'm gonna just keep it to actual uploads that I've done on the channel, and it's just gonna be completely random. It's gonna be randomized. So it could be a really popular video, like for example, the pre-release opening that it is a very popular video and I think at the moment it's at like over 300 likes so if that one gets is the winning video it's a booster box right now but basically yeah it's all decided by you guys it is all decided by you guys so if if we can consistently get 300 likes on every single video it's like a guaranteed boost box for the giveaway so yeah it's kind of it's it's a work in progress guys but I'm gonna keep keep kind of doing these these giveaways over time and uh, we'll get there it'll get to the point where you guys are gonna be uh, making making me broke by giving away one of everything <laughs> in the giveaway I'm gonna mix up the prizes obviously we'll do like collection boxes and other things that are more like I'm gonna try and keep it new and relevant as well like for example we've got a, a Lucario GX box which is pretty pretty awesome I'm, I'm sure one of you guys would love to win one of those I might throw that in like the next giveaway as well as like a tier a tier one prize. You're leaving game night though. Thanks for coming and hanging out. Hanging out in the stream. Brody, do you like Typhlosion? Yeah, I do. I do actually love I love Typhlosion. I like all all three of the uh, Gen 2 starters, final evolutions. I think they're great. I'm just upset they didn't get like megas like everyone else. What keyboard do I use? I just use like an old school like Logitech keyboard it's just like a wireless wireless keyboard so we got the DC in there we just got that ugly ugly Bruxish there 
I will stay for a long time. You got heaps of time to kill EF Nation. I'm glad. I'm glad we're just kind of here, chilling, killing. What is my favorite Gen 3 Pokemon? Ooh, I don't know. That's a bit of a hard question. I've never really thought about it, to be honest. I've never really thought about like what I would consider to be my favorite. So what should we do now? We should do some Guardians Rising just to mix things up. Just to mix things up. Let's do a bit of Lele, Lele DCE hunting. What's my username on PTCGO? Let's go. I think it's just straight up that. Amity TCG. No spaces. So we just got an Ori Koryo inside of that pack there. Your favorite Pokemon is Typhlosion. I'm glad. Have you have you seen the uh, the mega concept art for Typhlosion that's been kind of going around for a long time now? It looks powerful. If they made the mega Typhlosion look like the concept art that's been going around, that thing is absolutely amazing. I'd love to see that like be a reality. But we got a Reverse Holy Rare of an Absol, and then we just got a Turtonator. Regular rare there. Welcome to the stream, Strike Ninja. Thanks for coming and hanging out. What's up? Oh, nothing too, too much. We're just here. We're just going to be cracking into some packs here just to build some inventory here on TCGO. I need to, uh, I need to get more cards in the collection so we can... So, so when I'm creating decks, I can make something <laughs> without having to crack into packs to try and find something or organize trades. I'll, I want to just build the build the inventory. But we got a Lilligant regular rare there. I opened the Alolan Raichu figure box and pulled a Mewtwo EX from Breakthrough and Alolan Muk GX from Crimson Invasion, a Gogurt Hollow from Crimson Invasion, and a regular rare Eradicate from Evolution. So that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Two Ultra Rares and a Hollow out of four packs. That's that's definitely definitely a win for sure. Especially out of a um, a Lolan Raichu figure box. I actually still need to open that one on the channel as well. I've got it. I've got it just behind me. It's in, it's in the Amity wardrobe. Just kind of chilling, killing there right now. But I should definitely get cracking into that thing as soon as possible. Might even throw it up uh, tonight or tomorrow on the channel. Who knows? Open it after the stream. <laughs> I'll just get hyped after the stream. Welcome to the stream. Hey, LMAO. How's it how's it going? I'm, it's going pretty good. It's it's pretty early in the morning, but I'm feeling pretty, pretty solid considering it's like 10 o'clock, and I usually wouldn't even wake up till 10 o'clock, to be honest. To be honest. Welcome to the stream, uh, Sarah Troy. You're from Ireland. Ireland that's that's ages away that's that's kind of wild we have uh, Samantha from Scotland and uh, and Sarah from Ireland chilling in the stream today welcome to the stream a bushwhacker <laughs> thanks for coming and hanging out we're just cracking into some packs here I have an EX power keepers deck still sealed I'm pretty sure you showed me that on Instagram in the direct messaging I just didn't get back to you I saw the, was it a, the Mighty Anna Power Keepers Deck Strike Ninja? I'm pretty sure it was the, uh, the Mighty Anna. If it's buffering, uh, if it's buffering, you might need to drop the quality down to maybe like 480p or just re uh, refresh the stream EF Nation. Everything should be, I'll just double check everything right now just to make sure the stream is running smoothly. It looks like everything is all good. I got the green light here saying that everything is fine. Let me just double check. Yeah, it looks like everything's chilling, killing here. But yeah, if you guys want to contact me in any way, shape, or form, uh, through Instagram or Twitter is usually the best way to do it. I'll drop links to the socials in the chat there if you guys would like to would like to go check those ones out. But what should what we should do now? Uh, what should we do now? Sorry, if I can English right now, we'll keep doing Guardians Rising for a bit. We've got a, we've got a um, fair few packs here before we hit the big hundred. Okay, so what do we have inside of this pack? We got the Tentacruel, we've got a Clefable, and an Oricorio regular rare. According so far, Guardians Rising equals poo. Yeah, it, it has legit, like there's been nothing out of every single pack that we've cracked into. It's like, 
they intentionally have dropped the pull ratios right now because of Lele. They're like, nah, we're not going to give people as many ultra res because Lele is just too heavily desired right now. Legit, it's just all regular rares right now. Okay, come on. Oh, we got a hollow. Hollow Blissey. What does Fresh Egg do? Fresh Egg says, when you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon, during your turn, you may heal 80 damage from your active Pokemon. I guess. And then you got double edge. Look at that huge retreat. You just uh, throw a float stone on there for sure to get rid of that, that retreat. Brody, I have a Tapu Lele GX and you want a Gen 2 pack sealed. Yeah, you need to get, if you're gonna buy any Gen 2 packs, definitely get Neo series. My recommendation would be Neo Revelation. I love that set, but yeah, I can, you can leave it up to, up, up to you personally, but the Neo series is definitely the best throwback Gen 2 series to crack into. I love it so much. And then we go, we get the Blissey reverse holo there. Going back to back. And a hyper rare. Come on, oh, there you go. The calm before the storm. Here it goes, here it goes, guys. So we got one hyper rare, and now from here, it's just gonna go up and up. We're definitely gonna get some epic pulls from here. You followed me on Instagram? Thanks for the follow, Jody. I appreciate it. We got two Komodo, Komodos here. The hyper rare, of oh, the hyper rare variety on TCGO. <laughs> the real Josh wants to battle. A bit later, Josh, if you're watching the stream right now, just hang out till a little bit later in, in the stream and I will, I'll verse you later on. For sure. If you guys, if you guys have me on TCGO, yeah, definitely just hang out to the end of the stream. Don't send me any re requests right now and we'll, uh, we'll have some matches at the end of the stream. But we've got Lycanroc GX here. It's got 200 HP with bloodthirsty eyes. Claw slash and dangerous rogue GX. Uh, when you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Training Kid 1000 says Guardian, Guardians Rising now equals smiley face. Yeah, it's it's doing something. We we just got the hyper rare and then we just got a GX as well. Finally. After like, I don't know how many packs, like 12 packs. How is the stream for everyone as well? I did, I did hear that uh, there was a little bit of lag going on, but uh, how is it for everyone in the stream right now? Let me know in the chat how everything's going. But there is a Tapu Koko GX. We got three of those now here, which is awesome. That's, that's what I like to see. Did someone say that they'd like to see my entire collection? Uh, I would love to show you guys, but you know how long that would take me to do? It would take me like hours. Like I could do it on stream and it would still take me like so long just to get everything out to show you guys. There's just so much stuff. I could probably split it up and put it into videos on the channel and just do, do like portions for you guys. But like, I don't know, let me know in chat if you guys would like to see that on the channel. Just like me showing off bits and pieces of my collection in like sections. Uh, Brody, do you have merch? No, at this current moment, I do not have any merch. Um, I'm trying to think of some good designs, to be honest, if, if I'm being 100% real with you guys right now. Everything's good. It's a little slow, but it's all good. I'm on Gym Challenge and Gym, and gym Heroes. Is that collecting, Justina? Are you, are you collecting Gym Challenge and Gym Heroes? Like the, uh, the throwback Gym Challenge, Gym Hero, Hero, Heroes, like Wizards of the Coast boost packs? I'd love to crack into some of those. But once again, like the old school packs are just so pricey. If I were to buy them, I couldn't bring myself to open them up, to be honest. Like if someone sent one in and said, Brody, you must open this, I would cry and then then I'd open it, but it would still just tear me apart. Like cracking into the old packs, it just, it, it, it's tough. It's tough. Even when I see a Plasma Storm and it's not even that old, Plasma Storm, Plasma Freeze, and like any of the black and white, early black and white series, I'm just like, I don't know if I could do it. I don't know if I could do it. But that is my very first Drampa EX here on TCGO. Wow. I cracked into like, what? 150, nearly 200 Guardians Rising packs and this is my very first one. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. That's kind of wild because I have like four Tapu Leles, but I've only got one Drampa. 
<laughs> what is the logic there, guys? What is the logic? But it's got 180 HP with Righteous Edge, Berserk, and Big Wheel GX. What does Big Wheel GX do? For one colorless, it says shuffle your hand into your deck, then draw 10 cards. Okay. What is that? <laughs> what is that? Now the hits are getting insane. Yeah, the hits are slowly picking things up here. We got the Requaza there with the Turbo Storm. Not bad. Sees a little bit of play here and there. Yeah, draw 10 cards. What is what is that? That's kind of wild. Justina says, I'm trying to get my Gen 1 cards in set order, and it looks sad. I'm missing a lot of the cards. Yeah, it's kind of like... That, that's what happens when you start setting up the, the binder early. So usually what I do personally before I start setting up the binder is I'll just kind of store things away. Like, for example, when I crack into... Uh, Ultra Prism, I've still got my pre-release cards that I've got from the packs there in like an elite trainer box right now Kind of just stored aside rather than trying to start to make a set binder I just hold things off to the side and once I start to build up a bit more of that set Then I'll throw everything together if you keep them in an elite trainer box or like sealed up the cards the cards maintain Maintain a pretty good uh, like condition have I met Unlisted Leaf? No, I've never met Unlisted Leaf. I've actually never spoken to Unlisted Leaf, not even in the DMs, guys. Fun fact. But also another fun fact that uh, Unlisted Leaf was actually at Universal Studios in Los Angeles just the other day, and a fan met him there. I saw it on Twitter, but uh, I was also in Los Angeles like literally last week. I was there and I was going to go to Universal Studios as well, but I was a little bit unwell and I decided to just kind of hang out at home. Well, not at home, but in the hotel. It was it was on the plan, it was on the agenda to do, but I didn't uh, I didn't quite make it there to Universal Studios. So yeah, it, it's kind of interesting. And then yeah, he was he was there just the other day. So if I timed my holiday like a week later, there was the potential the potential for us to meet up at Universal Studios kind of wild are you gonna do viewer battles yeah later on in the stream creeping fruit, uh, fruit I will do viewer battles if you want to add me on TCG I'll drop it in the chat right now my uh, my username is just Amity TCG it's pretty simple no spaces just got a talent flame regular rare there hey Dawson and Zach welcome to the stream thanks for coming and hanging out but we get a choice band there how many of those do I have 26 <laughs> 26 choice fans. That's wild, but not of the secret rare variety, which is unfortunate. In Australia, does it go over 100 degrees? Yes, it does. It, it does, especially in uh, in Sydney. Uh, just recently, they had a massive heat wave, and it was definitely over 100. Definitely over <laughs> over 100. But we have a Toxpex GX Hyper Rare. I thought it was the Tapu Lele. I'm just saying, I got my I got my hopes up, and then it was just like. Still to this date, no Tapu Lele Hyper Rare. Not on TCGO, not in my collection. It's like, it's just, I just can't get the expensive cards, guys. I can't get the expensive cards. SCP Pogue, welcome to the stream, man. Thanks for coming and hanging out. Uh, did you know that Dragon Ball Super TCG has textured full arts now? I'm gonna pick up a Trunks one because I can do excellent Trunks impressions. So Trunks is my boy. Trunks is my boy. Future Trunks, not baby Trunks. Future Trunks with his sword. Oh my god, I have a nerdgasm over, over his character. I love it. In the games, I was playing like Bodokai 2, Bodokai 3 when I was a kid, and he has this attack called Burning Attack. It is it is insane. I love it so much. His character is just so badass. I, it, it is amazing. But yeah, we got the high for rare tox specs there. That is, that is awesome. That is my very first one here on TCGO. That's awesome. <laughs> Lance Leroy says Tide Pods. Keep keep that out of the chat, Lance. We don't want to hear anything about Tide Pods. That is the stupidest challenge that's like has ever even became a thing. That is ridiculous. I saw those when I was in the US in the uh, di like dishwashing aisle. We don't have those in Australia. We don't have the, the things called Tide Pods. We probably have a different version of them, like an Australian version. But Tide Pods, don't don't do it. That's stupid. I only have three sets left to Gen 1. It's a little hard to get those cards these days. Yeah, collecting the old school cards, like, I I respect anyone that has any of the early sets. I have base set unlimited, and that's it. 
when it comes to the OG sets. And then from there, I have from Plasma Blast up. That's where my, I have like a massive gap where my collection is just nothing. Absolutely nothing. One set that I do want to collect on the channel and like kind of do a bit of a search for with you guys is Dark Explorers. It is a very expensive set, but it is my favorite set um, from the black and white era and it needs to be a thing. Accept your friend request. Yeah, I'll go through and accept uh, friend requests just after we crack into some packs here. Actually, I might after this pack, I'll, I'll accept some uh, friend requests. So if you guys want to add me once again, I'll drop it in the chat. Amity TCG. That is my TCGO username. I think that's what you use to add me. But yeah, Guardians Rising has gone, gone dead. So let's go here. Let's go to... Let's get a request here. We've got two, two requests here. Let's accept that one and accept that one. Just remember guys, there is only a limited amount of people we can have on the friends list here. Hey yo, hey yo. Let's just drop something into the, into the chat there just for the lols and the memes. But let's go to Crimson Invasion. Let's, let's spice things up. We're gonna do like heaps of just Sun and Moon. Sun and Moon series boost packs here. I'll link you my Trunks Impression video on Twitter if you want. Leia, definitely. Definitely hook me up with your, your Trunks Impression for sure, man. And let me know, also FCP Poke, uh, what set is the very first Dragon Ball Super set to have textured full arts? I'd love to know, because I actually wouldn't mind to crack into it and just see it, because I'm a DBZ fan. I love Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball Super has been an awesome series as well to watch. I've been watching the dub. I haven't been watching the sub, but yeah, the dub has been very enjoyable to watch as well. But there is a playset, finally, of the Reverse Holo Type Nulls. That's awesome. That is awesome. I am awesome. Thank you, Dawson. I am flattered. I am flattered that you think I am awesome. Oh, yo. Yo, the man himself. The Buzzswall. GX. It's got 190 HP with Jet Punch, Knuckle Impact, and Absorption GX. I should totally make a deck surrounding him. I have five, five Buzzwall GXs. I know people would kill to have this card right now. I just have five of them just chilling, chilling, killing. I think it's the most recent one. I'll research it for you. I'd appreciate that. That'd be awesome, man. If you could, if you take the time to research and find out what, uh, what Dragon Ball Super Set has the textured full arts? I'd love to know. <laughs> that would be wild. I can just imagine like a future Trunks full art with texture. I'd love that. That card would be amazing. Have you ever spent over a thousand dollars on Pokemon at once? <laughs> Have I ever spent over a thousand dollars on Pokemon? Oh, man, this is kind. Of, it's kind of embarrassing. I've done it like five or ten times, <laughs> like easily, at least five, at least five times I've spent over a thousand dollars on Pokemon at once. Like for example, if you guys wanted to know, like straight up base set boost box that I have in my collection, uh, that was two thousand Australian dollars, but that's over a thousand US as well. Uh, Dark Explorers boost box, that was a thousand dollars as well just by itself, so that's two boost boxes alone, that's over a thousand dollars. And then I've just spent like over a thousand dollars on sealed products all at once, just multiple times. It, it's so embarrassing. <laughs> it's so embarrassing that I can just drop a thousand dollars on Pokemon products. So like, and and with no regrets, guys. I, I do it with no regrets. It's embarrassing, but no regrets. I need a bus fall, please. Uh, see, I, I knew it. I knew everyone would want a bus fall as soon as they saw that card. Bye, I need to go. Thanks for coming and hanging out, Dawson. Yo, Brody, how's it going? Yeah, pretty good, Stephanie. Pretty good. I'm actually feeling really good today. I'm just gonna, I'm just kind of sitting here drinking like a mix of juice. It's like golden passion, like juice mixed with like pine orange right now because it was like little bits and pieces of what's left. I don't know if you guys do that, but if there's like kind of like two different drinks that would taste all right together, but there's only little bits left in, in like, in the in the jug, for example. Just finish both of them off so you can get rid of the, the trash out of the fridge. I don't know, that, that's what I do personally. If there's like a little bit of something, I just have to get rid of it.
Is there a specific Pokemon that I collect exclusively? Uh, not at this current moment, but if I did have to pick one, it would definitely be Darkrai. My boy, for sure. My boy Darkrai would be the card that I would collect exclusively. I would buy so many Darkrai cards and have no regret regrets. I should actually start doing that, to be honest. I'll just get a Darkrai binder going and fill that thing to the brim with just Darkrai's on Darkrai's. If I had to, Jack, a boy says, if you had to choose Booster Kings or Unlisted Leaf, my boy Booster Kings, any day, any day, friends, friends, like a priority for sure. I've never met Unlisted Leaf. I've never spoken to Unlisted Leaf. I'm sure he's an awesome guy for sure. I'd love to meet him, but my boy Booster Kings is always going to be the priority. I had to sell my secret rare fairy energy card for bills last week, so I was kind of destroyed about that because I wanted to hang on it to see if the value rises. Yeah, see that that sucks, man. I'm sorry to hear. I'm sorry to hear that things are tough at home, FCP. Like when it gets to the point where you have to start selling your collection to like pay off pay off things, it just yeah, it just really hurts. And I, I feel you. I feel you there for sure. Gotta go. Thanks for coming and hanging out, hanging out in the stream, Jody. I'm glad you could make it out. And I'll catch you in my next opening, or maybe in a in a future stream for sure. Hey, Brody, I watched your stream yesterday. It was cool. I'm I'm glad you enjoyed enjoyed watching the the highlight of the stream. <laughs> Have no fear, Falcon is here. Welcome to the stream, Falcon Gaming. I'm glad you could make it make it out today to come and hang. Chill and kill while we crack into some packs here on TCGO. This is probably the most packs that I've cracked into on stream today. We're kind of just like going through. We got the Alolan Golem there. I'm kind of just like slowly fading through a uh, lots of stuff and we'll stop and and really appreciate the the full arts and the the hyper rares. <laughs> I see, I see you, Jack. You you tried to meme. You tried to meme me. But do I know the way? I I do know the way. Do you know the way? Do you guys know the way? Let me know in the chat. Do you guys know the way? Are you collecting Japanese cards? Uh, no, not at this current moment. See, I don't. I just don't have the money. I, I feel as if when you collect something, you need to dedicate your heart and soul to that one aspect of what you're collecting to really get the most out of it. So, for example, English TCG is going to be my main focus. But another thing that I'd love to do is collect pop, <laughs> pop series figures. I love those things. They're so cool. They just take up so much space though. But uh, see, if I were to collect Japanese cards, I would only collect Japanese cards. I'd dedicate all of my attention to that. I, like, I wouldn't mind to open up a boost box here and there of the Japanese series cards. But yeah, when it comes to collecting, it just doesn't... Uh, it's not a thing right now. It's definitely not a thing. It hasn't been something that I've looked into all too, too much to see if it would work on the channel. I'm sure it would if I cracked into in, into some Japanese stuff. You guys would get to see the, the, the cards that are coming out in the next set early in Japanese and I would get to see them early as well. But at the same time, I, I love waiting for the, the English set too. It's kind of nice just to wait it out. You're gonna open an actual packs anytime soon. I c I was actually considering opening up a boost box in today's stream, but I think I might I might hold off for today and just we'll keep it TCGO. But if you guys would like to see me crack into some packs, I could probably make make it work. We could do some packs from the Lucky Dip box um, a little bit later on in the stream. But yeah, let me know, let me know in the chat in, in the chat, guys. Ironically, one of my favorite personal collection cards still has good value. That's rising. It's a holographic Pilot Swine e-reader card. You know the cl clay art kind. See, I know the e-reader cards. What set's it from? FCP. What set is it from? Is it from like Aquapolis or uh, one of the 
was it Team Aqua? Team Aqua, Team Magma? Was that E-Reader? I'm pretty sure it was. And then there's Sandstorm. I know a couple of the E-Reader series. Thanks for coming out to the stream, EF Nation. I'm glad you could make it out today. Open some Shining Legends. See, I'd love to, but the Shining Legends uh, stock is pretty low right now. And then on, uh, in the last stream as well, we had uh, had a request from uh, Mega Man. Mega Man came out, dropped a $2 donation, and was like, yeah, open up some Shining Legends. So we did it. Of course, of course, I, I did not acknowledge the, the donation and was like, let's do some YouTube hunting. And what do we do? We hit the Mewtwo, <laughs> Mewtwo Secret Rare from Shining Legends on the very first pack. I should totally upload upload that to the channel as a highlight from that stream. That was like insane. I couldn't believe it. It was just like donation request pull done. It was so it was so wild. We're gonna beware holo rare. What's Fluffy do? This Pokemon takes 30 less damage from attacks of your opponent's non-fire Pokemon. Non-fire type Pokemon. Okay. It's not like the greatest ability by any means. See, Gladion's interesting. It's like what, you, you play it, you look at your, your face down prize cards, and then you just swap it. Swap it around. So weird. It could be good if you're playing something like my, the Guzzlord Darkrai deck that I'm playing right now, where if your Guzzlord gets prized, you want to get that out ASAP. So um, swapping it with Gladion is definitely something that could be a thing. It could be a thing. <clears throat> What's my uh, Pokemon trading card game online name? It is Amity. TCG. I'll just drop it in the chat for you guys. Just there. What are the main cards I'm aiming for right now? At this current moment, I'm kind of just building inventory more so than <coughs> more so than looking for a particular card. But right now, I'd probably be looking for in Crimson Invasion. There's nothing right now. Maybe just more Buzzwalls. Just this trade bait, to be honest. Buzzwall Full Art. Buzzwall Hyper Rare all of the trade bait and there we go that is a gladion that is a play set of gladion full arts right now here on tcgo speak speak of the devil speak of the devil uh roblox thomas says two kits of pre-release today another one tomorrow so stoked awesome how are your polls been from the pre-releases if you guys have been to a pre-release as well in the chat let me know your polls that you've got from ultra prism so far my luck uh, in the US wasn't the greatest. We got we got some decent polls. If you guys have seen that opening, you guys would have seen that. Uh, see, seen what I got. I'm not going to spoil it for, for those guys who have not seen my Ultra Prism Pro release opening yet. But yeah, it wasn't too bad, but it wasn't great by any means. You should know the way to the Ultra Ball. <laughs> the Ultra Ball is just not a thing. It's just it's just non-existent. Let's go. Let's talk talk bad about the Ultra Ball and then pull it. Right here. <clears throat> Just gotta clear my throat. Got that morning voice going on. That morning voice. But we got a crushing hammer. This thing is the biggest troll. I was versing a what is it? A it was a carnivine deck with Raticate, with crushing hammers, team flag runs, and it was all about destroying energy. And it just it just made me run a rage so hard. It made me run a rage so hard last night. I was using my, my Guzzlord Darkrai deck. But there's the Lunala GX. There is a playset here on TCGO now. That is awesome. That is awesome. But yeah, this was this was trolling me so hard. It, like the person that I was versing kept getting heads. My energy just kept getting discarded. L luckily I have a Brock Grit in, in this deck that I'm using. And I was able to replenish a lot of my energies from the discard pile. But man, it was just so like, so trolly. I still lost, I still lost. It came down to the last turn, but I still lost. Uh, have I got a Mega Charizard? I think I do. I think I do, in fact, have a Mega Charizard. Hey, Ollie55, welcome to the stream. Thanks for coming and hanging out with me. We're just here. Oh, is that my first one? That is my first Orangaroo Full Art. I have four or five of these in Reverse Holo and only one Holo Rare Orangaroo. I noticed this last night because I was looking for it for my uh, my Darkrai Guzzlord deck that I'm running right now. 
and just like playing around around with it. It's not the best deck by any means, guys, but it's it's something. It's a work in progress. It's a work in progress. But yeah, we got the Orangaroo Hollow there, so that can replace the Reverse Hollow that I have because I do like the the look of the Hollow better than the Reverse Hollow. But let's just make sure everything is still. It looks like everything. We got the green light here on the stream. I'm just gonna make sure everything's running smoothly for you guys. Awesome. Cool. 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 Alrighty. Looks like everything is is going well. Sweet. Arongaru full art. Oh, whoops. <laughs> whoops. Did I say Arongaru full art? I I always do that. Like for example, this one. There's this one meme on one of my multi collection box box opening videos that I did like Christmas like two years ago where I said Bridget EX Full Art. I think I pulled a Bridget a Bridget Full Art, but I called it a Bridget EX Full Art. And I everyone was just take like taking the piss out of me in the in the comments section. I was just it was so it was so funny, but at the same time I was like, God damn it, I'm so stupid. Why am I so stupid? What GX or Full Art card is your favorite in the new Ultra Prism set? I haven't seen the full set yet. I have kind of avoided looking at what is in the in the the entire set just to give me a bit of a surprise, just to keep it fresh for the channel and just for me personally. I don't like to <laughs> dig too deep into into the set, but here he is, the troll himself. I thought I was going going to get away with not pulling him on TCGO, but there is the Gumshoes GX Full Art. The man himself, the troll of the channel. This thing, it hates me. We don't get along. I don't like Gumshoes. Gumshoes doesn't like me. It's a, it's a bit of a hate-hate relationship that we have going on here. We got a Passimian here, not bad. Not bad. And what do we have? Just that Bruxish, lots of Bruxish. We got eight of those now. Eight of those here on TCGO. <laughs> Excuse? me excuse me guys that was that was kind of out of nowhere i didn't expect a burp because i'm just drinking drinking the oj yeah trump himself has come out to play guys trump himself has made his presence aware in the stream he's come to say hello <laughs> trump senpai <laughs> trump senpai but Crocodile, just a holo rare there. Alrighty guys, so what should we do here? I'm gonna take a pack request, single pack request in the chat guys, go. Name one pack and I'll open it right now. Any pack that you guys see right here, absolutely any pack. First in, best dressed. I'm gonna wait for it, we've got a trade offer. Hey Josh, just wait till, uh, till later on in the stream or after the stream to send me trade offers and um, battle requests and we'll do them after or later on in the stream. Looks like Furious Fist, Luis Santos got in first there with Furious Fist. So let's crack into that. We'll, we'll do it again later on in the stream. I'll get you guys to, to request a request a pack and for, it'll be first in best dress and I'll crack into whatever pack you guys say. But here we go, here's a pack of Furious Fist. Let's see what we can get. Let's go, so we got a Combuskin. Actually, we'll do one more right now. We'll do one more right now. So drop in the chat right now. So we just got the Goth the Tower regular air. So nothing all too fancy there. So from right now, from below, Pokemaster. Uh, Pokemaster's message says legendary treasures, legendary treasures. So below that, the very first one will be the pack that we open next. Who's gonna be first? That is the question. Lance Leroy is the first one to drop a pack a pack in the chat and says evolutions so let's go let's crack into a pack of evolutions <laughs> oh, i love it i love it to see see, see who's first in best rest it's great Alrighty, so in this pack of evolutions we've got some some awesome awesome ones there we got the crystal onyx there that throwback art to the crystal onyx from the anime, then we got a Pokedex, we got Slowbro Spirit Link, Slowbro Spirit, Spirit Link Reverse Hollow. Is that the first one of those for me? It is indeed. It is indeed. And then we have a just a regular rare Doug Tree. It's got 90 HP with Slash and Earthquake. 
YouTube comment section is the best and the worst of our kind. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. The meme is there. The meme is there. Hey, Jaden B, welcome to the stream. Thanks for popping by. Thanks for popping by. But let's go. Let's go into a match now. I'll show you guys this this deck. So let's go into the deck manager here. And let's show off what I've been talking about throughout the stream. I call it Munching on Energies. It's a, it's a bit of a funny name. But here in the Munching on Energies deck here, you guys can see. So I'm going to, actually, I'm going to swap out that Oranguru real quick. Let's go, let's throw that in there. Oranguru. Let's go to the Hollow and let's throw that one in there. Let's, let's save it before I forget. And let's go back in. And show off this here. So this is the this is the deck that I was kind of mucking around with last night. It's it's something. It's a bit of a twist off something that Dark Integral Gaming did on YouTube, and I've kind of twisted things a little bit, and personalized it and made it the Amity the Amity com combination here. Not until later on in the stream, guys. If you guys want to request the battle, do it do it a little bit later on the stream. I'll let you guys know in like when to when you guys can battle me later on in the stream we're just going to do some public battles for a little bit here but yeah so if you guys want to add me on tcg as well once again i'll drop it in the chat there you go that is my that is my username but yeah so this is the deck here we're rocking we got that one orangaroo just for the just for the purely for the ability and then just for that odd chance where someone has something that blocks out uh, EXs and GXs and stuff like that. Well, GXs in particular, like for example, Hooper here with the Scoundrel Guard that um, prevents all effects from GX and EX Pokemon. And like Nine Tails as well is another one that is a bit of a problem. But yeah, let's just go straight into a battle here. And let's see, see what's done. Let's see if I can actually make this deck work for once instead of losing all of the time. I lost so many times, it was ridiculous, like last night, I was like, oh my god, I can make this work, this deck can work, I know it can, I'm just not doing it right. Okay, so let's, let's do this, let's, Tails never fails, come on, okay, it fails. I have no basic Pokemon. Rip. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what we can do. So in this deck, I've got lots of. I added a couple of extra energies to this one. We've got the Brock Grit there, uh, which is pretty much useless at the start of the game, until you can get some uh, some deck movement going and drop some drop some cards. Thanks for coming out to the stream, Jack. I'm glad I'm glad you could hang out with me for as long as you did. Let's just throw that there and that there for now. We'll throw a Darkrai straight up. You don't have enough energy in your deck? Yeah. See, that, that's what I thought as well, but you would be surprised. You would definitely be surprised. So it looks like this guy's rocking a, a Guzzlord as well, but he's got the Full Art. I don't think I actually have the Full Art Guzzlord at this current moment. I was thinking about throwing in a couple of extra energy. Because this deck definitely is very heavy, like heavy on the energy as well. But you would be surprised how it kind of flows with the uh, with the energy that I have here. So let's throw this on Darkrai, and we'll throw that on Darkrai, and nothing for now. We'll just leave it there. Yeah, my uh, my TCGO username is. Amity TCG. There you go. Oh my god, I just played Stabby Cat. How'd that go for you, <laughs> Blaze Can Blast TCG? Let me know. Was uh, was Stabby Cat using this this deck that you're seeing right now, or was it a was it a different deck? Okay, taking his sweet, sweet ass time. Okay, thinking it out, grinding it out. Eat sloppily to get those energies up. 
no nothing <laughs> rip <laughs> that was an epic fail that was crazy that was crazy fail oh, I can't do anything it's just like I need I need to get the Zerua down early but I haven't got anything in my hand right now to get a refresh I needed like an N or a sycamore or just something to to get some sort of movement going but right now it's kind of just going to be plain energy and just see see what's going from there yeah see i i could but dark ride takes like it, it doesn't take much to, ch to charge up like i could i could definitely if i if i was able to get a float stone on hooper but see at this current moment, how my hand's gone, I haven't got a float stone to throw on Hooper to, to get that, that retreat going. And I haven't even, like, hit a... I haven't hit a Max Elixir yet in my hand, either. There's there's nothing really really going for me right now. It's kind of just, just simple, just just knock out this Guzzlord. I feel as if this is going to be the tank of, of the deck, and if I knock this out early, it's, it's pretty much it. But at the moment, I think I'm going to get knocked out. But I will be able to get Hooper out, which means I'll have plenty of time to set up here. So right now, this guy will get two prizes. He'll either use, most likely will use Tyrannical Hole for 180, which is knockout. Yeah. Oh, Jessica plays, just subscribe. Thank you for subscribing, Je uh, Jesse, sorry. Jesse plays. I get, gotta get ready for work. Catch you later. Thanks for hanging out in the stream, SCP. It's always a pleasure hanging out with you in the chat. Hanging out with everyone in the, in the chat. We know the way for Guzzlords. Yeah, see, Guzzlord seems to be a bit of a thing right now. I've seen a couple of decks floating around with Guzzlord in it. There you go. There's my boy on the bench there. You got the Dark Darkrai there. There you go. So there's the Tyrannical Hole. But we got the Wishful Baton here. So I can get the, um, get Hooper... Hooper going here. And we are safe from the Guzzlord. There's nothing that this Guzzlord can do to us right now, but we can do damage to Guzzlord. So that is something. So I could Guzma right now, and I could draw something else out. But there's nothing that I can knock out right now. There's, there's literally nothing going for me right now. I could throw like an... No, I don't want to throw another energy on there right now. Let's just... Uh, actually, no. Let's let's keep chipping away. Let's just chip away at this Guzzlord and see if we can make something happen. Because right now, there's nothing that this guy can do to me with the Guzzlord. These two are the problems, and that's why I have Hooper in here. It's just a good safety when you're in a bad spot like I am right now, because there's no damage that can get done to this Hooper by. GX's or EX's. Oh yeah, I could have um, I could have used Darkrai's ability restoration, got Darkrai back on the bench. I keep forgetting about that. That's that's where I'm like hashtag amateur amity TCG, and I just I just make like the the littlest of mistakes here. But at the same time, if this guy is playing Guzma right now. If I actually have something on the bench, that's actually a problem. Because he could just Guzma, get get the Darkrai out, and then off we go. There we go. Gu um, Guzzlord is now on the bench, and they have realized that this is a problem. This, is, this Hooper is a threat right now. So let's go. Another Guzma. Oh my god. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on. Uh, let's... Let's see. So it's got 90 damage on it so far. What I could do right now. So I'm going to get Darkrai. Let's get Darkrai. Restoration. And I'll just throw an energy on Darkrai. I don't have any energy in my dis discard right now. We'll throw that on Darkrai. And what I can do is I can actually get the Guzzlord back out. And then we'll, we'll get Darkrai out. And then we'll kind of just chill from there. Because this Guzzlord can't do any, anything to me right now. Unless he gets a DCE. If, if Stabby Cat gets a DCE right now, we're, we're in trouble. 
but I'm hoping, I'm hoping there's no DCEs. So there's one there, but that got discarded before. It's running this dark right here as well. Okay, so I need something, something to start moving here. Because I can probably just Guzma straight back into Hoopa if, if things don't go my way with this next draw. Because I really need to get this out. Once you, once you can get Zorok out, you can get some flow going. Because you, you can use Trade, get rid of um, Dark Rise, throw them into your, your discard. And then just get, get them back out with an energy if you can get some energy in your discard as well. Hey Xander Hurley, welcome to the stream. What's up? Just we're just here chilling. I'm just uh, kind of mucking around right now with this Guys Lord GX deck. I was gonna do this anyway off stream, so I was like, oh, why not? Uh, why not do it on stream and cracking some packs with the fam as well? Can I trade with you? If you have uh, a trade request, feel free to do so and just drop a request. I am not guaranteeing that I will. I will accept the request. But yeah, definitely feel free to send me a request here on TCGO. Okay. So we got Oblivion, we attach a Darkness Energy from your discard pile to one of your bench Pokemon. So see, that's not too bad because that goes well with, uh, with Guzzlord. Because you can get one out of here to stack that. It looks like we got another, another Evil Toll going there. I just can't get any luck right now. Like, yeah, we can wish we can wishful batten there, but I might just what I might do is I'll I'll Guzma out. We'll throw this energy on Darkrai, but then we'll Guzma, and we'll get what should we get out right now? The Guzzlord is a threat. The Guzzlord is a threat. So let's let's get the Guzzlord back out. And let's just continue to continue to super cyborg here and we'll we'll eventually get this guy's lord. I'm pretty sure what, what this guy wants to do right now is stack this guy's lord, because unless unless they can throw down a float stone or something of that nature, that retreat is going to be a problem. Four retreat is huge. But we got the evil top break there. What does that say? Let's turn my head sideways. Why doesn't it let you just like flip it horizontally? Uh, this attack does 30 damage to each of your opponent's benched Pokemon. Okay. There's 20 to the main and 30 to the bench. Gross. I'm not a fan. Definitely not a fan of that. Because what is... What is the weakness of... Because you get like this. Hold on, give me a sec. Weakness is lightning. Okay. Alrighty, so we got the Zoroa there. Uh, we don't have any energy, so I can't get anything on Darkrai right now, but we'll just kind of, we'll just keep, keep chopping away here. See, they've got the Darkrai in the discard pile as well right now, so that's, that's a threat, and they've got Darkness Energy too. The last thing I want, want is for them to get that, that on the field and going, but then this is a problem as well. <laughs> the Veltal break, because my Hooper has... It's got nothing on this evil toll. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. This is where it begins because I couldn't get anything flowing right now. Okay. Hey Pokemon Master, welcome to the stream. Let's throw this down. Throw the parallel city down, just like that is fine. Let's throw that down. Uh, let's tr let's trade. Let's get rid of Guzma. Even though that could have been could have been helpful. Let's throw down the Oronguru. Instruct. Let's throw. 
what should we do here? Should we throw, yeah, we'll throw this on Darkrai for sure. Definitely, definitely throw that on Darkrai. Uh, we'll keep keep the Zoro in hand for now. This will go down next turn. That should be fine though. We'll just do 80 with Super Cybolt and then just keep going from there. I don't know, I'm kind of stuck right now. <laughs> the, uh, Nahush, Nahush plays, hi. How are you? I, I see I see you there with the the six highs. Now you're in action. Yeah, I've got the Zorok going so I can kind of start kind of start getting my hand going, but I don't know where like I've got sycamores in here, I've got like four ends in here, I've got a Shauna in here as well. Like I don't know where they are. They must all be in my like prizes. And that's why things aren't going how they should be. But let's let's actually throw this Zoro down. I don't need Okay. <laughs> why why do you do this to me I'm guessing it was just it was just going too slow for their liking it was too much of a too much of a challenge and they're trying to get Guz, Guzzlord going but look at that the MVP being being Hooper there with 450 damage <laughs> pull out Charizard no deck is complete without Charizard just, just playing. I have no, no idea how to play the game. It's not well. Playing TCGO is definitely the best way to learn how to play the game because you can do like the trainer challenge here, which is is pretty annoying. I've done it. I've done a little bit of a, a little bit of the trainer challenges here. I'm only on like platinum. I haven't done city championship or anything like that. But basically, you have these like decks down here that you can unlock, and then from there you've got these. I've unlocked five out of seven cards to add to this deck. But then once you, once there's no bar down the bottom, you've got the whole deck there. And basically, as you beat the trainers, you'll unlock cards for these decks to help you beat the trainers more easily, if that makes any sense. But let's go into here. I believe we had some friend requests that, from you guys in the chat. So let's, let's go, go ahead and add you guys right now. Let's go like this, like this. Alrighty, and we got some some trade offers. I'll check those out after the stream as well. But let's let's go into another match here, and let's see if we can get some like some movement going here. Welcome back to the stream, EF Nation. What what did I miss on the Savage channel? Ah, uh, you just missed out on someone basically wasting my time and surrendering instead of playing out the match because they could have actually probably won that match then if they kept going, but they decided to just wuss out and give up. So it ended up being a pretty, pretty boring battle. Okay, so let's go, let's go second. What is this song? This is uh, Champion Iris, the Champion Iris remix from Black and White 2 by Glitch. It's awesome. So let's throw it out this, and Lele can just chill in the hand. But yeah, if you guys ever are wondering what song is playing, just uh, feel free to let me know in the chat and I can let you guys know at any any moment. At any moment. But let's let's just go with that. We don't need anything else other than Hooper here. See this thing, it's just basically it wasn't in the original build for this that I based this deck off. It was something that I personally added just as a safety to go against EX and GX decks. Just so I can literally just troll them and destroy them. Because a lot of there's a lot of decks out there. Like for example, here your boy Guzzlord is back at it again, once again, <laughs> in the TCGs. Can't come through to say hello. Let's see. For example, Hooper here. Hooper here just shuts it down. There's literally nothing that this can do to me right now. Hey, can you fight me next, please? There you go. Easy. Easy. Everyone just goes, no, nah, it's not happening. They just what's out. They they see that I've shut them down, and they cry, and quit. It happened so many times last night. I think I went like eight wins in a row just with people just quitting. But then I was raging as well when I actually came up against like a good deck <laughs> because I couldn't. I I had no practice to make it work. But we got a little Shebe in our versus rewards. That's awesome. Yo. 
We can get some boundaries cross packs. Let's let's get some. Let's work towards getting some boundaries cross packs on the stream. If we do get those, I'll open those on stream as well. That would be kind of wild. Pokedex plays. I'll verse you a little bit later on the stream. Pokedex plays. I did see your message just then. We will um. Well, I'll verse you a little bit later. I want to work towards getting uh, those boundary cross backs right now. But definitely, I'll play you later on. I think I was versing one of uh, one of you guys last night as well. That was using a Salazzle deck. I can't remember who it was, to be honest. If you're in the chat, let me know for sure. When do I end in the stream? I'll probably end the stream, I don't know, maybe in like another hour. Depending on how things go, I'll probably just chill here, play some TCGO, we'll crack into some more packs, and uh, go from there, I guess. I just kind of wing it, but let's throw let's throw Hooper out again. Hooper seems to be the seems to be the thing right now. Thanks for coming and hanging out hanging out in the stream, Lucario fifty four. It's always a pleasure hanging out with you in the chat. When I ever when when I try to make a deck on TCGO, it never works. Oh, that's I make a an account for TCGO. How does that work? That's unfortunate. I don't I don't actually know how to help you there, a person. <laughs> I, I don't know how to help you there, but that, that is very unfortunate that you can't uh, create an account. It's very fun. I, I'm quite enjoying this. I haven't been playing TCGO for very long, but I've been enjoying playing on here lately. It's been great. It's been very entertaining. Okay, so we're just waiting for my opponent to make their move. So yeah, if you guys are chilling in the chat right now and would like to verse me, we're going to be doing viewer battles towards the end of the stream. So feel free to hang out if you guys would like to like to make that a thing. But let's go, let's just leave it this way. Let's, let's block them from having any more than three on the bench. Let's get a basic out. We want that Zerua out as soon as possible. And then I don't know if I should... What should I do here? Hmm. Should I get Dark Ride prepped or should I... Should I have something on Hooper? That's the question. That is the question. Maybe... I might, I might throw it on Hooper for now. And I'll get some I'll get some energies, these two energies in the discard pile as well. And prep that up in advance. Because we've got Hooper here. I'll I'll leave that for now. Actually, we don't want the float stone on there right now. We'll kind of just hold on to that. We'll just we'll just leave it there. And we'll just hold on to the float stone. Because I'm not sure if if I get enough energy on here, I can actually I might just throw the float stone on Hooper. That might be a good call. Might be a good call. So we got Muck here, it says, yeah, each basic energy in play, in each player's hand and in the player's discard pile has no abilities, okay. Apparently this Hooper is now useless because of Muck. Okay. Sweet. That's, that's definitely not good. Point attack for 60. Okay, well, 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 what do we do here? We don't have any any ability, so let's float stone Let's throw this darkness energy there And I guess I'll just throw oh we could we'll end We'll get a fresh hand going See if I can make something happen with a fresh hand Which It doesn't look like I could get rid of the poison barb actually or just we'll field blower and we'll just get rid of that poison barb. Those things that are annoying. Altar of the Moon. I remember I just threw that in at the end of last night. Because basically what it does is the retreat cost of Pokemon, both yours and your opponents, that is psychic or, or darkness, has is two colorless less. But in this situation, this would help help my opponent out. See, so we got the Lunala deck going. The Lunala Tauros combo. So I might 
I might Ultra Ball here. We'll get rid of that and that. And let's get the Zoroark. Because what you can do as well is you can Marlo. You can get two cards on top of your deck that you need and then you can Zoroark for them as well. So let's go Retreat. Let's let's throw out... Should we throw out Zoroark or Darkrai? Zoroark or Darkrai? Darkrai for sure. Zoroark we need for the trade. We need for that trade. But for now... For now we'll just wait it out, I think. Because I reckon on, on, on our next turn, we'll draw an energy. I'll play Marlow. I'll be able to set up. I can play Sycamore, discard my hand that is non-existent, draw seven cards, and then we're sweet to go. Alrighty, let's quickly, quickly do this. Let's put uh, wholesale, <laughs> wholesale Boo War in timeout mode. Just spamming the chat. Totally just spamming the chat. There you go. So there's the prediction. So I get the energy. I play the energy. I play Marlo. And what what do we want here? We want We want a Rongaru. And then we want Guzzlord. So we get both of those. Yeah, mod can stop spammers. That is a thing. Uh, so I could trade. I could trade, get rid of Sycamore, and draw two cards, but I don't think I will right now. I think we'll just leave it at that. Darkrai can kind of just chill here. I'm really hoping that next turn we can get a Wishful Batten, or not get knocked out by this Tauros right now. Okay, so we're at 120. We got the Aronguru there that we set up before. So right now I can, I'll just Sycamore. I can get a fresh hand here. Then we got the Guzzlord that I, I set up as well. And then from here we can, we can max Elixir. Throw that energy on Guzzlord. And basically this is where the stacking begins. So we can throw that on on Darkrai there, even though Darkrai is just about to go down, and there's nothing I can do about that either. There's nothing right now that I can do about that. Oh, actually, I can't. Oh no, I can't go I've already played Sycamore this turn. What could I do? I've pretty much got everything that I need, so I can probably get rid of this Ultra Ball right now. Two more cards. What do we got? Nothing's really doing. All right now, I'll leave that leave that spot free for now. We'll just dark cleave. I was really hoping I got a wishful baton, but it's just not a thing. See, that would have been perfect if I had have got a wishful baton. Then I would have been sweet. But I'm guessing that my wishful batons are here in the prizes or in the last 23 cards of my deck. Yeah, Pokedex plays. I did, in fact, see your Discord idea. I haven't actually, like, I briefly had a look at it, but I haven't had time to actually sit down, and I want to go back and refer to that when I'm actually going to make a Discord right now. So for now, it's kind of like the email is there. I've read it. I, I definitely have read it, so I will acknowledge. Uh, I've acknowledged that it's there, but I just haven't... Um, I haven't made any progress with the Discord so far, but yeah, I do appreciate the time that you've taken to... Uh, create that and send that to me as well, but I will yeah I'll definitely get onto that when I have 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 the chance Alrighty cuz we're gonna get knocked out here for sure this Taurus has got us And because I didn't get that wishful baton uh, We're in a bit of in a bit of trouble right now we're in a bit of trouble because this has no no abilities because of the mark. I couldn't Guzma. What could I do? What could I do? The only thing I'm thinking is probably just throwing Zorok out, out right now. 
Um, so let's Lele. I need... Let's get an end. Let's see if I can get an end. Actually, it's got no ability. God damn it. That muck is trolling me so hard. That was such a fail. I totally forgot that, that it has no ability. That's what that little arrow means, hey? Yeah, this, this, this Pokemon has no ability. Uh, that's a problem. That is a problem. So let's... I guess we'll just swap out. Let's throw... What should we throw up? I need to get this muck up right now. I need it. I need to get this muck out of play. So let's go. Let's just throw Hooper up. Why not? It's got the free retreat if we ever want to get get Hooper out of the front lines here. I don't know. I don't know what I should set up right now. Maybe. Maybe Zor Zorok. I'll just throw it on Zorok for now. I'm in a bit of a bit of a bad spot here. I was thinking of building a similar deck, but I had to add more Oronguru because I don't have any Tapu Leles. Yeah, see, that's that's unfortunate. The the Lele, I just can't seem to use it in the in the best way to get it to work the way it should. Like I, I see a lot of people are able to do. I, I'm not the best at making the call when to play the Lele. It's very important when you play it because you need to play it when you need a specific supporter in a certain situation where as I'm I'm not too sure when I should use a Sycamore or when, when I should use an end because obviously right now an end would be perfect for me because they would get four cards, I'd get six. So that would disadvantage them having less cards in their hand. But um, other than that, it's just, yeah, I just I just make so many misplays when I play through and they always end up being very, very costly. Like, for example, this, this muck out of nowhere has been... <laughs> has totally... It, how did it get... Oh, it got Psychic transferred by Lunala. That's a problem. That is a problem. But they, they did just get rid of a lot of energies. So there goes Hooper. 150 damage there. Oh, poor Hooper. So the question is, who do we throw out? Do we put up a Rongaroo and just kind of deal with, or do we try and do some damage here with Zorok? Let's see if we can do some damage. Why not? Let's see if Zorok can put in the finest of work here. We got the backup Zorua there, ready to go. Let's throw this energy, energy on that. We don't need the nest ball right now. The bench is, is looking pretty solid. So there's that. We've got, we've got another Hooper. There's our wishful baton. We can definitely use that on Zorok right now. We could throw that on, who else could we throw that on? Maybe this other, other Zorora as well. We'll get that set up. And then what we can do is I can trade. What do I want to get rid of here? I don't. I do want that wishful baton, so maybe just an energy. I think, I think that would be fine to get rid of an energy. What can we get? It's because we just got another energy there. We've got the Ultra Ball, so I could Ultra Ball right now for for another Zoroark to get that set up. But I think I'll wait. I think I'll wait for now, and I'll just do Righteous Beating for knockout there. So it gets rid of that problem. So we do get two prizes here. And I'm hoping from here I can get Guzzlord set up and we can we can destroy stuff. So what is what's going on here? So there's the altar of the moon. Which is a bit of a problem because now now they've got free retreat. I've got free retreat as well on a lot of my mons. But so do they. And that's what I don't like about the altar of the moon. It benefits both people, not just you, I'm pretty sure. Of each Pokemon, both yours and your opponent, yeah. Hey Brody, I finally um, got a new account and made my own deck start. Nice. Feel free to add me. My, my username is just in the bottom corner there of the gameplay. Hi, do you see my comment? I do in fact see your comment, Dawson. I do. So there is there is the, the Zorok there. So let's play that. 
Let's throw... Oh, we don't want to throw the DCE down. We want to get Guzzlord stuck now from here. That is that is the plan. We want to get our Guzzlord going. So let's... Let's end. Let's let's reduce reduce the my hand and my opponent's hand down. But I've still got a couple of things I can do here. I don't have many dark rides going right now. I've only got one one there. I can get I can't get that out right now because of the mark. But we do have seven energies in here. So what what I can do right now? Oh, not right now, but next turn I can I can definitely set up that Brox grit and get all of those energies back. But unfortunately. We couldn't hit an energy with the max elixir there. But can I can I trade right now and get we'll get rid of Hooper. Can I get an energy? No, I got Darkrai there. So I could probably play the Darkrai. I could throw the wishful baton down. I don't really have anything else going for me right now. I could trade again. Nah, we'll just Righteous Beating right now. We'll Righteous Beating for Knockout. And then we'll just make do with what we've got here. Somehow my first time with my deck, I won because the guy forfeited. Yeah, it just happened so randomly. I, I don't really understand it at times. People are just randomly, like right now, it'll be mid-game, everything's all kind of like set up and they'll just quit. I don't know if their internet just like died or they were just bored or had to go somewhere. Who knows? Who knows? I got something in my eye right now. Excuse me, guys. There it is, just an eyelash. Oh, there's two. There's two. There we go. Or oh, three. Dang, three eyelashes just then. That was that was gonna be painful. Oh, don't you hate it? Don't you hate it when that happens? Just out of nowhere, your eyelashes just just start falling everywhere. Um, should we Brock script or should we? Hmm, that's the question. Because we can do, we can throw that on Guzzlord. And then what can I do from here that would definitely do some damage? Because we can... We can Lily... Or we can Brox... We definitely need a Brox crit. That, that needs to be a thing. I need to get these energies back. For sure. Actually, we'll drop one of those and we'll get... Oh, should we get Hooper or Darkrai? We'll get Darkrai. Get lots of energy and we'll get the Darkrai there. That's kind of kind of broken, to be honest. But we can trade here. We'll trade. We'll get rid of. We'll get rid of Lily. My win streak. I don't even know what the win streak is right now. To be honest, I think we're only like three or four. <laughs> There's the dark rise. So that's that doesn't really help right now. But um, we'll get we get the dark rise back just to get rid of the dark rise because of its ability. Once we can get rid of that muck, then we're sweet because we need Guzma. That needs to be a thing. Uh, right now, I don't know if I... Do I risk it for the biscuit? I think I risk it for the biscuit. With the righteous beating. Let's go. Risking it for the biscuit. And let's see, what do we have in our price here? There's there's our max elixir that we we're looking for like ages ago. I really don't want to, want my opponent to get set up right now. That's that's a that's a big problem. See what we can do here. So so what I want to do is I want to I want to max elixir. Let's see if we can get that energy. So there's one. So we go we go like this. We can max elixir again. Hopefully we can get another energy. We got three of them that time. So now that's that's all set up. That's good to go. Then from here, I have a choice. What can I do? Oh, what could I do? I can throw out this. We can we can Guzma. And I can get rid of this muck. With Zorok. So then we get we get the retreat. The confusion goes. Then we can I could trade, but I think I'm I'm pretty satisfied with how things are right now. And we'll righteous beating for 120. Knock out that muck. And oh, we got the super rod there. 
There's, there's our other energy retrieval there. You got the, the super rod. But how's everyone doing in the chat? Let me know. How's everyone's day? What's the weather like? Where, where are you guys from? I'd love to know in the chat, guys. Hashtag Shocky Diamond Raid. Are we getting get, getting like a little mini raid right now, guys? Shouts to everyone from uh, shouts to everyone in the Shocky Diamond Raid. Thanks for coming to the stream. Feel free to feel free to hang out for as long as you please. We're here. We're just uh, testing out like a a uh, Guzzlord Darkrai combo deck with a uh, with a hint of Hooper as well, just for all the all the trolls and the lols. Oh, but what should I do here? So what I can do is I'll throw that on Darkrai. Uh, how many energies do we have in our discard pile here? We got two. I could just throw the. I'll throw down the Super Rod just for the lols, just for the lols and the memes. And we'll do that. And then we'll get. Oh, should we get a Rongaru back? Or Hooper? We'll get a Rongaru back. Let's do it. From the Netherlands. That's wild. That's so wild. What's it like in the Netherlands? What is it like? So we got this. I can do some chip damage here. So yeah. So let's. Oh, actually. What, what do I want to do now? What I want to do is let's trade. Let's throw out this energy. Because what I want to do is try and how many how many Guzmans do I have in my discard pile right now? I got two, so I do still have one. I should have one left. So let's try it again. Let's throw away another energy. Unfortunately, we couldn't we couldn't hit it. But I'll throw down the Orangaru. Uh Let's let's end. Even though I'll get one card, that's fine. That's fine. We got an Ultra Ball. I'm just, I'm just kind of hunting right now, hunting for that, that last, that last, um, that last Guzma, because that'll, that'll be GG. If we can, if we can hit that, that'll be, that'll be. Oh, okay. Apparently we had Knockout. I, I, oh no, not Knockout. What is it? What does it have? 250 HP. Okay. I see. I see. We were so close. If we had Choice Band just then, we would have definitely got Knockout. I didn't even take that into consideration. So it's got resistance there. Pretty much like the thing with this Guzzlord deck is basically you set up Guzzlord and then what you can do is you can do the Glutton GX, do 100 damage. If it knocks it out, you can take up to like a maximum of four prize cards. But here, I don't even need to do anything. We've got this. I can do anything from here. I can attack or I could just do like insult to injury right now. We can retreat into Guzzlord and I'll just, I'll just Glutton GX just for the memes. There we go. All good time. So there's, there's a win. That kind of dragged out for a little bit longer than what I thought. Had like five cards left in the deck, but yeah. Yeah, welcome everyone to the stream. Thanks for coming and hanging out. While everyone's kind of here, let's let's crack into some packs. That was pretty solid. We're, we're working our way towards the um, the boundaries cross packs there, but we're, not, we're on a five win streak right now. So that's not too bad. But yeah, let's crack into some packs here. What should we do? Let me know in the chat. What what set should we crack into? Try and keep it from like for sets that are in rotation right now. So for example, like breakthrough, breakpoint, generations, kind of like all the way up. So basically from like here up. Let me know. What do you guys want to see? Accept your friend request? Yeah, sure. Let's go into here. Let's go to requests. And let's, is this you, Nicholas? Let me know. Is that you? Because I just accepted it. If you guys would like to add me as well, my username on TCGO is AmityTCG. I'll just drop it in the chat there. And once again as well, if you guys want to follow me on any any of my social media, it's all in the, all in the description of the, of the live stream, but I'll just drop it in the chat there as well for you guys to check out as well. But let's have a look, see. So we want to see some generation, some breakthrough, Shining Legends is going to be held off for now, guys, as well. Only 18 packs of that left, so I'm just going to kind of leave those there for now. They, they're good trade bait alongside uh, the Amity After Show needs a bit of love from Shining Legends, too. But let's go. Let's do some Breakthrough. I see that there, and we'll do some Generations as well. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. 
And we'll do some breakpointer as well. Mr. Toro says, let's do some breakpoint. Who else do we have here? We've got, um, who else do we have here? Super cute, Espeon Queen. It says, same Shocky. Shocky Platinum. Was that the, that, that the, um, little Shocky raid that we had? Was that from you, Shocky Platinum? Everyone dropping the hashtag, uh, what was it? What was the hashtag that was getting dropped? Hashtag Shocky, Shocky Diamond Raid. Already got the burning energy there. What else do we have inside of this pack here? We've got the Halucha. Reverse holo, uh, not reverse holo, sorry, just a regular raid there. We're gonna see some Sun and Moon. So yeah, we got the Parallel City there. I got heaps of those now. I only had like two of those as of like last night and then I cracked into a whole heap of Breakthrough. Just to see if I get, if we could get anything right now from Breakthrough, it'd probably be Empoleon. I wouldn't mind some Empoleons. There's lots of playable cards in Breakthrough right now and it's definitely gonna go out of uh, out of rotation very soon. But there's, there's so many cards in here. Once this set gets taken away, there's gonna be a lot of people uh, that'll be playing with their decks to adjust it to the new the new meta. But here is Neuvern Break, and can we get the double? We can! Oh my god, and that's a good, that is a good card to get as well. We got the Hollow Rare Octillery. That is actually my first one here on TCGO. I'll take it. That is kind of a win. That is kind of a win. I'll, I'll battle you later on, Josh. Don't mean to be rude or anything, but right now we're cracking into some packs. I'm not uh, doing viewer battles right now. Don't mean to be rude. But we got a hollow chest nord as well. We're going back to back there. Shocky Platinum just subscribed to the channel. Thank you so much for subscribing. You guys will hear every time someone subscribes, that would just be a derp. Derp. It's kind of hilarious. I kind of just set it up quickly before the stream. Yo, there is a mega Mewtwo EX. That is powerful. That is pretty powerful right there. All right, so we got 97, we'll make it a clean 95, and then we'll go on to a different set here. This might get me into the card game? Yeah, for sure, like, it, it's pretty chill. I, I'm fairly new to the card game, but it doesn't take very long uh, to adjust and get used to it. Literally just play the game, do the, the, the trainer challenge. You don't even need any codes or your own decks to do it. The decks are already built for you. You can use that, you can play and just get used to versus yeah. the, the CPU and go from there. Moonwolf12 just subscribed. Thank you so much for subscribing to the channel. Welcome to the Amity Empire. Welcome to the Amity Empire. But what would you guys, uh, what is your thoughts in the chat? Let me know, what are your thoughts on shiny hunting in the chat? Do you guys enjoy shiny hunting? Because your boy right here, I do quite enjoy it. Actually, I think I went over like way too many packs. Just then, we'll go to a clean, a clean 90, guys. Not, not 95. We, we definitely just broke 95. But yeah, what, do, what is your thoughts on shiny hunting? Let me know, guys. What does the C stand for? I don't know what you're talking about, creepy fruit. Let me know. Let me know what you're talking about, and I'll be able to answer that for you. If I, if I can understand, like, what's going on. Oh, Diantha Battle Theme Remix. Yeah, I think it is. Let me have a look. Let me have a look. Yeah, Diantha Remix by Glitch X City. So definitely uh, show some love to Glitch. I play a lot of her songs while I'm streaming. You search in the YouTube search bar, you go Glitch X City, and it's actually in the description of every single one of my uploads that I do on the channel. Literally every single one. If you go down, you can see where I uh, I get my music from that I use in my videos. The channels definitely show some love to all of the channels. But we got the, the Simi Sage there. This card's pretty cool. I don't mind it at all. But it's got Fire Fling there, so put three Fire Energy cards from your discard pile into your hand. Then Hand Fling this attack does 10 damage times the number of cards in your hand. <laughs> so you can just keep like loading up energy and just doing like mass damage. It's kind of, kind of cool. Dang, I gotta put this in my playlist? Yeah, for sure. It's, it's awesome. There's some awesome remixes out there. Let, let me have a look. Let's see if I can find a personal fave right now. Shell Cave remix. What else do we have? Well, that was a really good remix. I love the uh, Glitch X City Diamond and Pearl Route 209 remix. This this song's pretty cool. Let's turn it up just a little bit. Let's t turn the tunes up just a little bit here. Let's go like 
up to 10. It's so chill. I love the glitch remixes, just sound, just sound really relaxing. Okay, so we got the Raichu break there inside of this pack. That's not bad. How many packs do we have? Am I on 90? No, we got 92. So we got two more packs here. Hopefully I don't get distracted this time and have to go to a clean 85 and <laughs> just keep cracking into it until we have no, no packs left. Question? What question do you have, Falcon? Let me know. What is the question? We got Haxorus. That's a reverse holo rare there. And we got a Smeagol, just a regular rare. It's so chill. I love it so much. This song is amazing. We got that Meloetta there. That's not too bad. For sure. We're, it's just a chill stream. We're just hanging out, having a good time. But yeah, let's go into some generations. I did see that you guys want to see some generations here. But yeah, this um this song is amazing. Let's 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 knock the knock the tunes down just just a smidge here. But yeah, Glitch does some awesome remixes, so definitely, definitely go and check check out Glitch. Is there a way to change your TCGO name? I made the account a long time ago and I'd like to change it to something Falcon. Uh from what I'm aware and I don't think you can, but I haven't personally researched researched it to know. But we got a Gardevoir EX there as our first. Then we have a Machamp Reverse Holo Rare. And then we have a Gengar Holo Rare as well. That's kind of kind of cool. And that has like a very interesting kind of holo to it. It's got like a mix between black and white series and like XY series at the same time. That, that's so wild. That was a pretty solid pack there. Pretty solid pack of generations. Alrighty, so we have a reverse holo rare of a pincer and a holo Raichu. Is, see, is that like, is that a thing? I, I didn't realize that they had the lines through it on the generations holos. I, I didn't think they did, to be honest. Let's see, if I go back out and I go back in, I swear my like generations packs are like glitched. It does, it looks adorable. That Gardevoir EX actually looks so adorable. I think I have like, I got so many of those like tucked away in uh, in an elite trainer box, literally sitting right next to me right now. So nothing in that pack there. Can we battle now? Uh, we probably could, uh, Nicholas. Not not right now, but um, heading on towards towards the end of the stream, which is like pretty much now. I think I'm gonna wrap things up at around about midday, which is in about half an hour. So I'll definitely probably probably look at uh, doing some viewer battles now. But let's go. Let's do it. Why not? We're mid mid pack opening, but let's 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 try out munching on energies. Let's do it. Do I do I play Pixelmon? No, I don't play Pixelmon. I, I think that's is that Minecraft or is that just like a dedicated game? Like I've heard of Pixelmon, but I've never played it or watched videos about Pixelmon. To be honest, just being honest with you guys. But yeah, let's see let's see if we can make make this one a good a good match here so we got the guzzlord there we'll just throw a wrong guru up because we definitely want don't want guzzlord guzzlord in the in the main main fight right now do i play roblox i've never actually played roblox guys uh there's a lot of games that i have not played so if you guys have any game suggestions that i should play let me know in the chat what are you guys personally enjoying playing in your free time let me know because at the moment i kind of just play the pokemon games and pokemon tcgo uh in my free time as of right now first i battled po uh, pokemon and wife and now me yeah po pokemon and wife are amazing content creators so if you guys have not checked out pokemon and wife definitely show some love to their channel good friends through the youtube machine let's throw, throw that on guzzlord and it's my first turn, so I get to draw like eight cards, I think. Yeah, that's winning. Perfect. A Lily, Lily first turn. Let's throw down the Max Elixir. Come on. No, fail. Failure. Let's just leave it at that. Counter Strike. What time is it where, where I live? At the moment, it's 11.33 in the morning right now on the dot in Brisbane, in Queensland, Australia. 
Pokemon Diamond. Pokemon trading card game online and Overwatch. Yeah, I heard Overwatch is great. I love watching streams of Overwatch, but I've never played it to be able to give you guys an honest opinion of like my thoughts on Overwatch. But let's start getting this stacked. Let's let's shuffle this into the into the deck and get a fresh hand here. I play Minecraft in my free time. Yeah, I know I know a lot of people that play Minecraft and really enjoy it. It just never I never played it to be honest. Like I've never owned or played Minecraft to be able to tell you guys if I if I would enjoy enjoy playing it. Let's throw that wishful baton on, on Zoroa there. And let's get rid of Super Rod. Super Rod in the darkness energy. And grab out this Zorok real quick. And then what I should be able to do... I'll just end my turn there, actually. Notice me, Senpai. You've been noticed, El, Pro El Procrastinator. You have been noticed. What's up? Oh, nothing too much, dude. Nothing too much. We're just here. We're doing a viewer battle right now. So if you guys would like to add me, once again, I'll, I'll drop it in the uh, in the chat. My username for Pokemon Trading Card Game Online. It's just Amity TCG. And I'll also drop, drop my socials if you guys would like to contact me uh, after the stream. That's the best places to do it. Feel free to suss all those out. That is the, the place to contact me. No joke, I got in real life a Rainbow Mewtwo. That card is gorgeous. Hey, I just recently got that myself as well. That thing is amazing. Uh, let's... I don't even know what to do right now. I need to... Let's Lele. I don't, I don't want to discard my hand. So I don't want to Sycamore right now because I, I want Brock's Grit. So I think I want N. N or Shauna. Well, Shauna, actually, right now. I don't want to benefit my opponent in any way, shape, or form. I just want to I just want a fresh hand, and then we'll go from there. Notice you too. You've been noticed, Pokedex players. I see you there in the chat. Hey, Omar Santiago. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream, big fella. Let's go like this. Let's see if I can, come on, fingers crossed, energy. Give me an energy, oh my God, come on, man. I have no luck with max elixirs. I seriously have no luck with max elixirs. Let's just, uh, let's retreat into Hooper. God damn it. <laughs> let's, let's instruct, let's get an extra card in a hand. And then, no, I don't want to play Darkrai right now. Let's trade. Let's actually get rid of Darkrai. So what you do is you get it in your discard pile. And then from there, what you can do is you can actually get that Darkrai straight back, which makes this thing that's just absolutely amazing. And then, not to mention, you can just throw an energy straight onto the Darkrai as well. It's totally, it's totally a solid way to play Darkrai. You just have the combination of trade. Trade and restoration. But there's nothing else I can do from here right now. It looks like this Lapras is getting stacked right now. It's got an Aqua Patch on it. Oh no, an, an EXP share. So if I knock anything out, it's going to go to la that Lapras. So it's got three energies on it and an EXP share. So if we can get our Field Blower right now, that would be kind of appreciated. Um, do I want to limit their bench or destroy my bench right now? Hmm. I think I'll limit their bench. I'll limit their bench. Get them to discard a Pokemon off their bench. Maybe, hopefully. It'll probably just be the Keldeo. Yeah, there you go. There goes the Keldeo. Nerd Australia Gamer. Hey, how you doing? You've been noticed. You've been noticed in the chat. I think I send you a friend request. No worries, Falcon. I'll uh, I'll suss that out after the, the battle here. I don't think I can check. Yeah, no, I can't check them right now. I can't check friend requests right now, but let's go... Where should I throw this right now? Let's throw it on, on Darkrai. Let's... What should we do? Darkrai's not set up yet, so I'm not going to Guzma. We'll just end. We'll get a fresh hand here. We'll give them a fresh hand. But that's perfect. We got the Wishful Baton here. That's what I was looking for. Because I need that for Darkrai right now. 
And then let's... Should we trade? Yeah, we'll trade. Trade and then get rid of Dark Ride. Pretty much, whenever you use trade, you just look for Dark Ride. If you get a Dark Ride, you're good. <laughs> you, just, you just get rid of it. Then we'll just stall it out. One more turn. Come on. Things are nearly gone. If we had have got those max elixirs, if we didn't fail those two max elixirs just that like just before, we would have been sweet. Guzzlord would have already been set up. And then we could have been focusing on Dark Rye, but you know. You know. This song's awesome. What is this? I love the piano that Glitch throws in. This is the Rival Battle Remix, Johto Rival Remix number one, not V2. I love it. So good. Let's, um, actually, I just noticed while we're in, in battles here, the chat is a little bit, um, is a little bit kind of covered up there. So let's go like, let's go like that. Move the chat down just a little bit. I'm back for a tiny bit. Welcome back to the stream, Lucario54. Oh, my name on TCGO is just in the bottom right hand corner of the game screen right now. Let's throw this on Dark Ride before I I'll just quickly type it into the chat. Amity TCG. That is that is my uh, my username on TCGO. Uh, let's throw I could throw that on Hooper right now. And then what can I do from here? I could Marlo and then I can trade. I don't think there's anything else that I really need to set up right now. I can kind of just retreat out into Darkrai and start putting in some work from here, I guess. We'll just retreat out. We'll throw Darkrai into the into the fight here. And let's Dark Leave. Because what does Crystal Ray do? Uh, join your opponent's next turn. Prevent all attacks done to this Pokemon by evolution Pokemon. Okay. Hey, Genesec123EX, welcome to the stream. Brody, please fight me after so I can test my weak deck against your OP deck. <laughs> this, see, the deck is only as good as the user right now, and uh, I'm not the best user. Let's, let's be real. I'm not the best user of this deck right now. So what should I do? What should I do? What do we have in the, in the discard? You got to keep an eye on your discard here. You got to know what's going on here. I don't really need to do anything too, too much right now. I can kind of just keep chipping away. I was really hoping that this Darkrai would have taken some damage by now. But there's another Max Elixir. We could probably set up Guzzlord without even having to, having to really worry about the uh, Witchful Baton effect at this rate. Because I can pretty much end this next turn if I get the correct draw, and if I can get a max this max elixir to, to do its thing. So we got the Gyarados. It looks like uh, they're trying to set up a Gyarados right now. I don't know what's going on. S things seem really slow on their side of the field. So I'll play this max elixir. We do have an energy that's awesome, so I can throw that on Guzzlord. And then what I want to do is throw this energy on Guzzlord. We should be able to... Oh, I could Marlo. Let's Marlo, actually. That, that's a good call. So I should be able to... Do I have Guzzler? Uh, not Guzzler. Guzma. Guzma. That's what we wanted. And then we want... Just just in case, we'll grab, we'll grab the Ace Roller. Can I say your name for your brother? Poke Pokemon Master. There you go. I've said it. Your brother can be proud of you now. Okay, it doesn't really matter what I get rid of here because I'll just trade. So next turn, no, not next turn actually, it'll be the turn after. I'll be able to put in some work here. But we'll dark leave and we'll get the knockout here. Because what do I need to do to get this to really work? 190 HP on that Lapras. 170 on the Glaceon. I'll take my prize. We got the Field Blower. But this will set up the Lapras again. Or not. Apparently. Oh, actually, I don't know. Did that energy go into Lapras? I, I wasn't paying attention. 
Are you planning on going to the Collinsville, Illinois regionals? Uh, no, I actually live in Australia, so I'm, I'm like well, well away from the US right now. Yo, we just got a sponsor of the channel, um, Nerd Game, Nerd Australia Gamer. Thanks for sponsoring the channel. That is, that is amazing. There you go. There goes the Illuminati tune. Welcome to the Amity Empire, the Illuminati Empire. That is awesome. Thank you so much for sponsoring the channel. Let's go field blower. That is amazing. Thank you so much for sponsoring the channel. Let's let's get rid of the EXP share. And then what should we do from here? Let's go. I could probably just clean up with Guzzlord from here. We can just we can just Guzma. We'll throw out um what should we do from here? We'll get rid of Gyarados. Throw out good like throw out Guzzlord. And then from here, it's pretty much just a one shot. I was I was trying to get Glutton um Glutton GX going, but it doesn't seem like it's gonna work. I'm just gonna focus on the knockouts from here and we'll just clean up. But yeah, thanks thank you so much once again, Nerd Australia Gamer, for sponsoring the channel. You're the real MVP. I appreciate it. Okay, so let's let's take our two prizes here. There's a dark ride, there's a wishful baton. It looks like we have this one in the in the bag. You know, the games do take a bit of time, so you just need to be patient, Pokedex players. Definitely just be patient. We'll get there. There's so many so, so many of you guys, and there's only one of me to go around. So I try I'm trying to do the best that I can with the time that I've got. Okay, so what are we doing from here? I'm just waiting. Ice Beam GX does 100 and we're paralyzed. Okay, that's a bit of a problem. That is kind of a problem. Let's go. Let's just Guzma. What should we get out? Just the Articuno. And we'll throw our Darkrai, and that should be GG from here. I don't think there's anything that, um, that that can go wrong right now. That'll be knockout. My pleasure. My pleasure versing you, Nicholas Davage. I appreciate the game. I appreciate, appreciate the game. So we go Pokedex plays. Let's go. Alrighty. Let's let's give out the uh, munching on energies deck another hit a hit again here. Let's see what we can do. Amity poor Amity every everybody is like me me me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a hard life. It's a hard life, Falcon. I promise you. Thanks, Nicholas. It, it was a good game. It was a good game. Definitely stalled it out for me for sure. Definitely drag drag that match out. You did well. Alrighty, let's go Pokedex plays. Let, let's go like this. So, so usually when you, you verse someone that's watching the stream, what you do is you go like this. So now they can't see your hand. You guys can just see see me. Reminds me of uh, of the times too is like mum. <laughs> Mommy. Mama. I remember that. That's that such a funny episode. So I got nothing else to play here. There we go. So now you guys can't see the game. Pokedex plays. You can't see what's going on here. <laughs> Fight me, mate. Says Ancient MLP. <laughs> let's let, let's move everything back down to normal. Let's move everything back down to normal here. There we go. Alrighty. Let's see if we can make something happen here today. So let's throw this throw this on here. Let's restrict them to only three bench Pokemon. Then 
Let's end. Get a fresh hand here. Hey, hey, the cat hatter. How are you today? Welcome to the stream. Alrighty, let's just do Moonless Madness and get that uh, get that confusion going down. Hey, Brody, in the in order to possibly challenge you, do I have to send a friend request? Yeah, well, um, you, you have to have me add it on TCGO for sure to be able to challenge me. There's my username. I'll drop it in the chat for you guys. Hiking the Pokemon Center theme song. Yeah. Yeah, what do we got going now? This is actually a Zalia City uh, remix by Mewmore. Such an awesome song. It's so chill. Uh, so what are we doing here? Let's go... Let's throw that on there. And I'm kind of just gonna... Keep chilling. Chilling, killing, I guess. We could throw a Dark Ride down. Why not? We'll throw a Dark Ride down. And then... We'll just Moonless Mad... Uh, yeah, Moonless Madness for now. We'll just, we'll just keep it confused. Just do it, Just click on it for the memes. Can you start streaming more often? I can. I, I I probably can. Right now I'm actually on holidays from work, but I'm trying. Uh, I'm I'm trying to see what I can do from here. Man, my hand is not doing me any justice right now. My hand is just not doing me any justice right now. I don't want a float stone. We'll just actually. I I don't even know what to do right now. My hand is just not. Is not doing me any justice. Let's just throw the D the DCE on Dark Ryan in my turn here. And Brody, please have mercy. I I can't show any mercy. I can't show any mercy at all. That's that's no fun. Um, I don't I don't even want to use that right now. But I guess I guess I could. We'll just we'll just exp share. We'll we'll get this Dark Ryan going. Why not? Let's let's just change up the strategy here completely. Let's mix things up a little bit. Let's throw the float stone on there. And then let's let's guarantee my next draw. What is my next draw? What do I want my next draw to be right now? I want it to be. So my Guzzlord is is there. I could I could get that, but let's let's go. Sycamore. I definitely want a sycamore. And I definitely want to just kind of throw an energy in there as well. I don't know which card's going to be first, to be honest, but we can't do anything there right now. We'll just we'll just stall things out. Go all out. I, I wish I could. If my you you can see my hand on stream right now. It's terrible. My hand is not doing me any justice right now. Yeah, Chansey does 80. So what's that? Just straight up, just hammer in. Because what I can do... Oh, actually, that's my that was my benched one. You, my bench one got... I, did I swap that out? I can't even remember, to be honest. But we can just get that back. And let's throw, throw our other Dark Ray out. And let's get a reset real quick. Get a quick, quick reset. Let's throw that on there. I can't do anything right now with that. We'll just end it there. So what song's playing right now? We've got the Sinnoh Game Corner. Remix by Glitch. So right now I'm just gonna I'm just gonna throw that on there. Let's sick more. Let's finally finally get a fresh hand going. I don't think I'll need Hooper this this match here. We'll see. Let's go like this. Let's throw that and that out. I only need one the one Ultra Ball for now. Because we can just start getting getting the Guzzlord out from here. But I should be able to put in some work from, from here on out. 
I've got the wrong the wrong uh, um, attachments right now on, on my both of my dark rise. But we'll just we'll just dark leave. And from here it should be should be clean up. Clean up on our R3. I sent you a friend request. Good luck if we play. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. I'll check out all the friend requests that are uh, are in the request just after this match, for sure. But yeah, how's everyone doing? We got a powerful 19 viewers in the stream right now. How is everyone doing today? What is the time where you're at as well? Let me know. Let me know in the chat. I know it should be getting late for a lot of people. I'd say uh, west coast of the US would be like... Oh, it would be like 6 p.m. and then East Coast would be like 9 p.m. But yeah, how is everyone doing today? How was your day? What'd you do? Let me know. We're just here for a bit of a chill and a chat. It's all good times here. Let's throw this down. Um, we can actually nest ball right now and I'll get a, a Zoroa down. And then I'll end. Such a clean tune. I love it. Glitch does some awesome remixes. Welcome to the stream, Ana Loco. What's up? Nothing too, too much. We're just doing some viewer battles right now. Just chilling, killing. Just having a good time. Having a good time. Um, I just chilled today. Nice creeping fruit. That that sounds like my kind of day. Just chilling, killing. We'll just we'll just dark leave here. It's eight fifty four p.m. in Canada. So what would that mean? That's five hours different. No, three hours. Three hours. Fifteen hours different to what it is for me right now. That's kind of wild. Kind of kind of wild. Eight fifty-five p.m. Seven fifty-five p.m. Okay, so it's, it's starting to get late at night. It's, it's definitely starting to get late at night. It's just like the middle of the day for me. It's lunchtime. <laughs> Everyone's looking at going to bed, and it's time for lunch. Welcome to the welcome to the stream, Lucky Seven T C G. What up? Nothing too much. We're just we're just doing some viewer battles, chilling, killing, open up some packs. Ferris, welcome to the stream. Hey, how you doing? It's good to see you. Uh, what should we do here? Um, I might just end. End real quick. I was once using my Primal Growl on deck and the worst coincidence happened. The opposing person had a Primal Kyogre deck. That's kind of wild. The chances of that happening these days as well. That's kind of, kind of wild. Come on, give us an energy. There it is. And Max Alexa coming through coming through there and let's nest ball let's get our Aronguru out nice to see you loving that you're live streaming and that's great are you guys going to VidCon US uh, me personally I don't actually have any plans to go uh, to VidCon or even PAX at the moment in the US uh, I just went to the US on a holiday actually Ferris and and that was pretty fun I, I did a little bit of uh, tourist activities but I probably should have planned it a little bit better and I could have timed it to potentially visit one of the events as well. That could have been a thing. But yeah, at this current moment, VidCon is not not a thing. I'd love to go though. Definitely would love to go. Yeah, I went to LA, but I, yeah, I didn't go to any, any event. Oh, the only event that I did go to while I was in LA was a pre-release event for the TCG for the, the new set Ultra Prism. And that was pretty, that was pretty exciting. That was probably one of the, one of the best days that I had there as well. It was really chill. I met up with uh, Curious Clef at TCG. And that was really fun. Are you using Streamlabs? Yeah, I am indeed. So like any, uh, 
any people that subscribe to the channel and any donations, sponsors, super chats, that'll all pop up in the uh, top right hand corner of the of the stream. Uh, let's go. Who should we throw out right now? We'll throw out Darkrai and see how that goes. Yeah, you should have went to VidCon. Oh well, I have gone to VidCon one, three, and four. I'm finally going again. I think this is VidCon 8. Oh, really? I, I haven't even been ki keeping track, but I think it'd be a really enjoyable event for sure. I definitely love love hanging out with everyone at VidCon, just like meeting new people as well. It's probably probably be the biggest thing, just, just being able to meet new people and hang out with everyone would be amazing. Do you know the odd ones out? No, I don't. Let me know in the chat, who, who are the odd ones out? I'd love to know a bit more about what you're uh, talking about, Pokedex, uh, Poke, Pokeplay, sorry. Let's go, what should we do? Just kind of chill, we'll just we'll just leave it at that for now. I could get Darkrai back, but we can do that next turn. Yeah, it's super fun seeing people, yeah, definitely. That, that was kind of, the, kind of the main thing that I really enjoyed about uh, visiting the US. I hung out with, uh, I don't know if you know, the, the King Nappy, uh, Ferris. I hung out at, at his place for a day. That was pretty fun. We are actually supposed to hang out for like three days, but uh, plans kind of got got uh, pushed pushed back a little bit. But yeah, that was really fun. And then, yeah, like I was saying just before, I met up with uh, another YouTuber at a pre-release as well. And that was really exciting too. Did I go to Sushi Stop in Los Angeles? No, I didn't. I didn't actually go to a lot of the places that I wanted to go to. I got sick for like two days and that kind of like held things back and like ruined my plans. And uh, yeah, I kind of got trapped in the hotel for like two days, which is really unfortunate and kind of was like a major buzzkill on the trip. But it is what it is. It is what it is. I'm just gonna throw this on Dark Rider. Why not? Let's just sick more. And get rid of get rid of my hand. I had like a decent hand going, but let's get rid of the EXP share as well. That'll do. Oh my guy! Oh my god! Why did you get sick? Well, that sucks. Sometimes it's because of the smog. Um, I think it was just in general, just like with my body clock being so heavily thrown out by everything. I just had like a delayed jet lag and, and not to mention while I was at uh, at Nappy's place, we, we had a couple of drinks and I was a little bit hungover on my first day in LA and things went a little bit sideways from there. <laughs> it was probably the drinking to be honest, I probably just got like alcohol po poisoning or some, something of that nature. But yeah, I think it was just a combination of everything, just my body clock being so thrown out and then yeah, drinking wasn't the greatest. Let me just go like this. I just want to adjust the chat real quick. Let's knock it down. Somewhere down here. I think that looks a bit cleaner. Battleboy455 says, why is the stream cut off by one letter? What do you mean? What do you mean, man? I don't know what, I don't know what you're talking about. Let me just do this real quick. Arcanine Alex likes to say poop, so he's definitely got the uh, got put out in uh, in the naughty corner in timeout right now. Definitely actually, hold on. Ferris, where you at? Where you at, Ferris? Let me let me put you in as a moderator. There we go. Oh yeah, for sure. Lol. Did you say uh, say things were side? <laughs> Did you say things were sideways? That's a, a fun way. I haven't heard that. Yeah, things were a little bit sideways. We're definitely. I was definitely seeing things from another um another angle. And where's Falcon as well? Falcon, where you at though? Let's let's make your mod too. Let's get the squad going. Yeah. Yeah, he's in the naughty corner in timeout. What should we do here? Let's throw... Let's throw this on Guzzlord. I don't know what should, we should do, but we'll probably just keep keep Dark leaving.
<laughs> yeah. Falcons Gaming, you do have the power. You and Ferris have the power to clean up the stream. Keep the chat clean. Make sure make sure there's no, no spam going down. Oh, okay, so in the in the title of the stream, let, let me fix it up. Let's see if I can fix that up real quick. I, I quickly kind of just threw that together. There we go. Yeah, I see. Hang O U T. Hey, chills and hang out. There we go. That's pretty much what I do whenever I stream. It's all just chills and hang out. There we go. Let's go like that. Okay. It should be fixed. It should be fixed. There we go. Alrighty. So let's just go. Let's throw that on Guzz Lord. And I'll just. Um, go. There we go. We just got another another subscriber to the channel, to the Amity Empire. We got Pokemon Master just subscribed. Thank you for subscribing. If you guys are here and you guys have been, have been enjoying today's hangout in the stream, feel free to uh, drop a sub. Drop a sub just below the video. I love playing Pokemon TCG online. I actually just started playing like the other day, Ferris. Like to to be a hundred percent, I've I've played the Trainer Challenge in here a little bit here and there. Like in the past, I, I just muck around with the little basic decks and build build those up. But then other than that, I've never actually played like using my own deck. I, I kind of just like open up packs and went from there. Yeah, and they just started playing um, playing TCG recently. This is just me. Um, basically, I, I'm an amateur right now. This is this is me learning how to play live on stream with with you guys. Alrighty, guys. So who would like the next viewer battle? We'll crack into some packs while we wait. While we wait to see in the chat, who wants to battle next? Yeah, I got heaps of digital cards, so it was kind of good to just hold things off and like build up everything. Now I've just got like this, this mass amount of just packs to like, like cards to use from the packs to build all the decks that I want to. I can basically make anything that I want right now. What was the first EX I got my hand on? Hands on my first EX was a Chandelure EX from, from Legendary Treasures. This is actually the very first pack that I cracked in, into when getting back into the TCG. And I got a Chandelure EX, and that's what really kind of hyped me up into uh, collecting again as well. That was just like my luck of getting an EX out of the pack was just, it was just amazing. And Legendary, Legendary Treasures was such a, uh, such a good set. Oh yeah, I'll check out the requests. I did say that I was going to do that. Thanks for reminding me, guys. Let me, let me suss out the requests real quick. Let's go requests. We got show speed, 500. Pokemon Dude 7865. We've got Mr. Tauros 828. If anyone else would like to add me right now, my username, I'll I'll put it in the chat right now. It's just Amity Amity TCG. Pretty standard. Pretty basic there. But yeah, let's go, let's go back into Guiding Tries in here and let's crack into some more packs while while we wait here. We have Pokemon Dude 7865. Who's that? Let me know in the chat. Who, who's Pokemon Dude seven eight six five? I will I will verse you just after we crack into some packs here. Just gonna keep keep cracking into some packs. Oh, Arcanine Alex is back. The poop machine is back. We'll see. We'll see if the poop machine starts to fire off, and if he does, the mods can um <laughs> the mods can come through with the the timeout mode and put put Alex in the naughty corner. corner. George M is Pokemon dude. No worries, man. We can we can organize a battle. I'll just crack into a couple of packs. I want to see if I can get something amazing right now. I'm feeling. I need that DCE. I'm show speed 500. No worries, Falcon. Awesome. Awesome. I'll remember that. A next destiny pack. Oh, I don't know if I could do it. I'll probably do like a, a booster box opening of next destinies on the channel. An online boost box. I think that would definitely make an epic video for the channel. I'm in the good boy corner. <laughs> it says Battleboy55. 
<laughs> you definitely are. As long as you're not like uh, Arcanine Alex and become the poop machine and just start spamming poop, you you're all good. I'll look into making some more mods in the new f uh, near future Pokedex plays for sure. But for now, um, Farron and Farron and Falcon got the got the uh, fort held down. Can I open a Phantom Forces pack? I probably could do a Phantom Forces. I reckon I could throw throw a couple. We'll open up like five five Phantom Forces here. There we go. We got 99 Guardians Rising there. So let's do let's do some Phantom Forces. Why not? Did I call you Farron? Sorry, sorry, Ferris. I, I, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to call you Farron. I can't even English. Oh, that was a that was a solid pack. We got a Sycamore. We got a VS Seeker and a Reverse Holo DC as well. With just a Ven Venomoth. That's an unfortunate way to end that pack. That was that was that was pretty pretty decent. Yeah, there's li I'm literally not getting any Ultra Rares right now. What is what's the go? What is the go, guys? Alrighty, so we got a reverse holo rare and we just got the Blissey. What is my luck right now, guys? Okay, so we got the enhanced hammer there. We've got a target whistle. And we just got an X Bloud, a regular rare. Yeah, this is broken. Come on, Phantom Forces, show me some love. Show me some love. We got the reverse holo enhanced hammer, not too bad. I'll take all of the reverse holo energies that we can get, I'm uh, not energies, trainers that we can get. We can't even English right now, guys. How long have we been streaming for as well? It's probably been like, probably been a little while. Two and a half hours, that's that's not too bad. Not too bad, guys. Two and a half hour, powerful, powerful stream. So we got a Helioptile Reverse Holo Common there. And then we've got the Talon Flame, just a regular rare, once again. Here we go, here's the poop machine, he's coming through. <laughs> Arcanine bad boy. <laughs> lol, 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 lol. Let's. There we go. Ferris coming through. Ferris coming through with the timeout. No ultra rays. Le legit nothing right now. We've got that hollow, hollow slap up. Alrighty, that'll do. Oh, actually, we do. We'll do three more Phantom Forces just to get it to a flat sixty. But yeah, nothing. Nothing's doing right now. Definitely can't get any anything good right now. So we got the mystery energy, and then we've got just an explode. Two more packs here. Phantom Force is not showing me any love right now. I love this set as well. Absolutely adore this set. There's there's a hollow pyro. That's that's something at least. It's not not an ex or a full art, but it's it's something. Brody, when will you do the uh, do the next dip box video? The lucky dip box? Oh, I don't know. I might I might have to keep that one secret. It might be tomorrow. It might be the next day. Who knows? Who knows? Alrighty, so let's go. Was it one more pack? Do we have one more pack? No, that's the flat sixty there. So Phantom Forces literally had nothing for us in like what eleven packs just then. That's gross. That is gross, but I did, I did, who, who did I say I was going to verse right now? I was going to verse Poke, Pokemon Dude. So let's see, do we have, we don't have any requests, so that's all G. Oh, we do have a request. We have one from Ferris. There we go. Yeah, Pokemon Dude. I'll accept, I'll accept Ferris's request after this. We'll just go straight into the battle and then I'll come back and I'll, I'll accept your, uh, accept your, your request, Ferris. If you're still hanging around, Ferris, I'll verse you after this for sure. That'd be that'd be fun. I'd rather rather enjoy that. Alrighty, so let's go let's go second here. Alrighty, so let's focus let's focus on the match here. I'll keep an eye on the chat with you guys. You're off the video, nice, nice. Keeping it clean. 
keeping it clean. Alrighty, so let's focus on this match here. Let's see if I can see if I can make this deck actually like work and do do something <laughs> instead of just being like Amity fouls all day. Uh, let's go Darkrai there. You've got to go. Thanks for hanging out in the stream tonight, po uh, Pokey Plays. I know you've been hanging out for a bit. I'm glad you could uh, chill, chill and kill some time with the Amity Empire. And I'll see see you in the comment section below of my uh, one of my uploads or in the next stream for sure. I love this song. Is this by Mumor as well? Yeah, this is National Park by Mumor. I love this song so much. Feel free to check out Mumor as well. Make some bangers here on YouTube for sure. Show, show some love. Alrighty, so we got that hyper rare Lele though. That's gorgeous. See, why can't I get hyper rare Lele? I have the the worst luck, guys. I can't pull it in real life from out of what 300 and something packs that I've cracked into. I haven't hit a hyper rare Lele or a secret rare double colorless energy on TCGO or in real life. That is my luck. I've opened up like what 600 packs total between online and in real life, and I haven't hit a a single secret rare double colorless energy or a hyper rare Lele. Oh man, it hurts. It definitely hurts. But let's just get um, let's get Darkrai going. Let's see if we can get an energy, which we can't, of course. They're all in my hand. You guys can see them all there. Hmm. We'll just leave it there. My like max elixir luck. You guys will see all stream. The first two or three max elixirs will do nothing, and the last one will do something. I can never get just a clean run of just max elixirs coming through. How many sponsors do I have of the channel? You're actually the very first sponsor of the channel, Nerd Australia Gamer. Fun fact, you are actually the very first sponsor of the channel. And I appreciate it very much, Lee. Thanks for hanging out in the stream, uh, Misty Rock. I'm glad you could make it out today. Look forward to seeing you in the comment section of uh, of one of my uploads or in the next next stream yeah ferris i got i got a i got a sponsor today nerd australia gamer came through and sponsored the channel which is absolutely amazing definitely show some love in the chat for uh, nerd australia gamer but let's go should i get rid of some energy yeah we'll get a fresh hand i feel as if this will kind of just drag on if i just keep going going the way things are but let's destroy this fairy garden real quick. Let's get rid of this fairy garden and let's go. How do you? How do I like the ability lock? Yeah, I don't. I don't is it on here? If this Pokemon has a tool card attached to it, um, okay. I see you. I see you. So I can just go like this and this and clean up clean up on aisle three real quick but let's go wishful bat in there hmm and then from here i can kind of just end my turn there we go i see that i see you showing the love there creeping fruit <laughs> onwards gen three cards there's a lot of them I, are you moving on onward to Gen Three, Justina? I know you were talking about earlier on in the uh, in the stream. You're talking about how you're collecting uh, Gen Two. So you're moving on to Gen Three now. Okay, so let's go like that. Let's. I don't know what we should do here. Maybe we we could. What I could do is I could do that. And I want to get some draw, some draw flow going. So it looks like our Orangaru is in our prizes, which is kind of unfortunate. But I can also get that. That's what I want to. How long have I been collecting Pokemon cards? So it's kind of been, it's kind of been on and off for a fair, fair while now. There's not really too much I can do right now. But yeah, um, it's been on and off. So when I was a kid, obviously I I collected what I could with what my parents bought me and what I could personally buy with uh, pocket money and stuff like that. 
But then I went through a phase where I stopped buying Pokemon cards. They didn't become an interest to me, and I actually lost I lost my collection. Well, by lost, I mean I believe it got thrown thrown out by my mother. My mother, which is unfortunate, but yeah. It's a bit of, it's a bit of a long story but it's basically basically been I was collecting and I remember up to the end of the gym gym challenge gym hero kind of series that gym series back in the the wizards of the coast era and then from there I came back at plasma blast so right now as of right now since I've started the channel I have from plasma blast the master sets basically from there all the way up to the sun and moon series basically there we go let's throw that down that down let's get the experience share on Guzzlord there and then there's nothing I can do from there we'll just wait keep grinding it out the longer I take the worse it is though because this this Gardevoir is a problem I remember versing a Gardevoir deck last night and I got destroyed because it has resistance to me as well resistance to darkness Okay. Oh, there goes my wishful baton on Darkrai. That kind of sucks. Kind of, kind of sucks. Because this is Secret Spring. What does that do? That lets you get a Fairy Energy. Okay, and that you can attach it from your hand. I remember. I remember. And then what does Twilight GX do? It says shuffle 10 cards from your discard pile back into your deck. I remember. Because I, um, I think Charizard GX is, is like... Um, you can discard the top 10 cards off your opponent's deck. That That's, I can't remember what the attack name is, but that's Charizard. And then Gardevoir is like a, a counter to Charizard. Digimon copied Pokemon. How did Digimon copy Pokemon Creeping Fruit? Nice green screen. Yeah, it, it's actually really good. I love the green screen. It goes off. You guys can see. It's, one, it's, one, it's a very expensive green screen. It can kind of just slide up and down. But it does an amazing job, and the uh, the uh, capture capturing software is amazing too. Has no abilities, which is unfortunate. What can we do here? Can I make something happen? I can make something happen here. We can go like that, um, and then from there we can throw this on Guzzlord. I can retreat into Dark Cry, and then I can Dark Cleave for 130, which is Knockout. So that is the first Knockout of, of the match here. <laughs> Stop messing with time and space. Yeah, it's kind of trippy, hey. It's kind of wild. Digimon came out a year and a half after Pokemon. Yeah, I guess, like, there's that, but at the same time, there's got to be people out there that was thinking, like, similar ideas. And the whole concept of Digimon is so, like... Like, yeah, there's, like, evolution called, like, Digivolving, but it's it's so different to, to Pokemon. Damage increase, there you go. There you go. What can we do from here? Um, what can we do... Let's just select these three. Oh no, we got two. Two that we can get with the wishful button. And should I throw that on Zorok? And try and make Zorok do put in put in some work here. Yeah, I think that's gonna be a good call. For sure. Let's go done. And let's throw them on Zorok. Do I own a switch? No, I um I don't actually own a Nintendo Switch right now. I am looking into buying one in the near future, but at this current moment I don't own one because I don't actually have any games that have really drawn me into wanting to buy one right now. Let's play this on Guzzlord. Let's go. And... Alrighty, let's let's max Alexa. Let's see if we can get lucky. Come on. 
Just kidding. So what's that? What max elixir is that? That's number two. So like I was saying just before, my max elixir luck is just terrible. Let's let's nest ball here. Let's get. What should we get on the bench? We'll just throw. We'll throw zero on the bench. Why not? Why not? And then from here we can do some do some trick some chip damage here. Oh, we could do tricks to DX. That could be a thing. Infinite force attached to both active Pokemon. So how many energies do you have? You've got three, I've got two. They do 150. Uh, 150. Nah, no, we'll just we'll just ride your speeding for now. Do a little, little bit of chip damage. Why not? The next Pokemon games will be on the Switch though. That is the rumor. That is what everyone is saying, and that's why I am uh, slowly but surely putting some money aside for a Switch. I'll be out. I'll be able to adjust playing on the Switch like at any time for sure. It'll be it'll be really easy. R really easy to adjust. Let's throw poor poor little Zoro out. <laughs> why not? Why not? Uh, how many energies do we have in our in our discard pile here? We got four. Let's super rod. Oh, we can get basics as well. Let's go. Let's just get our energies back. Let's get three energies. Oh really? Oh, death by a switch. Oh well, that's the room is Ferris. E everyone's saying that it's it's gonna be a thing. Everyone's saying, everyone's saying that it's going to be on the Switch, but I'm not too, too sure, to be honest. I reckon they, they've still got some hidden surprise on the 3DS. I don't think they're quite done. they got to end it. They'll end it off with a bang. Yeah, they did uh, Ultra Sun and Moon, but I feel as if they've got something more. There's something more. Let's play games with this Guard of War now. Let's play some games. Okay, I see you. The field blower. Takes off the EXP share and the float stone. And that's it, okay. Alright, I see you. What can we do here? So what I need, what do I need? I can't use the ability of Lele right now. I could... I could risk it for the biscuit. Will Lily. Let's see, see what I get. Come on. Alrighty. Not, nothing's doing here. Nothing's doing. So let's just go Tyrannical Hole. Yeah, Tyrannical Hole. Why not? We'll just go Tyrannical Hole for Knockout. But yeah, that's that's it. That's 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 game from here. There's nothing that I I could really do. My hand just did not did not show me any love. But there you go, infinite force coming through with that huge damage. The, the fairy deck is is my worst enemy here on TCGO because Darkrai takes like three energies and then Guzzlord ha it just gets stacked with energy. So you come up against a, a God of War GX, it's pretty much rip. Like there's nothing you can really do in my situation. It's just a bad, bad combo. Let's crack into some more packs here. Alrighty, Ferris, let's go. Let's do this. I'll just open up this one pack here and then we'll we'll get into our, our battle. What do you got? Just a Hariyama. Okay, so let's go request. Tick, accept. There we go. Alrighty, so I don't know if I go. 
because I'm the noob here. What do I do? Do I go to, I don't go to versus because that's online. Do I just go to friends and I'll go to Ferris and then we, we just go like this. Darkness maybe and we'll go, we'll go this one here. I figured it out, there we go. I'm back, had to get, had to get a potato slice for my super worms. Oh, okay, what's, what, what's that Justina? Let me know, let me know what you're talking about there. What are super worms? What are super worms? What was your fave Pokemon from Sun and Moon except the starters? Mine was Beware. My favorite Pokemon from from Sun and Moon. I don't know. I got a bit of a soft spot for Mimikyu, but there, there's always something. There's something better that I'm not thinking of right now. There's this one Pokemon in Sun and Moon that's just amazing that I'm just not thinking of right now. Let's just play both Hooper. Why not? Why not? Warning: I haven't played in a while, but this is my favorite deck. Destroy me, Ferris. Show, show me how it's done. Clean up. Clean up my uh, my little Dark Ride Darkness deck that I, I've got going here. Worms with superpowers. So probably rocking rocking a Noivern break maybe. Or the no oh, it's Noivern GX. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what we got going here, but let's go. Let's play the Parallel City. And I might actually get Hooper. Hooper getting stacked right now. Let's end. If Ferris had any plans, plans right now. Nothing's doing. I feel as if whenever I use an N, I just end up helping everyone. <laughs> I just, I just end up helping everyone. I should, I should definitely get an NG right now because I have literally no energy in my hand. Let's throw it on Dark Rai. So you feed the worms to feed a lobster. That's interesting. So you like grow like farm worms and then feed them to other sea creatures of sorts. Is that right, Justina? Or just just a lobster in particular? Okay, so where do we got going? We got a Meowth here. I can put in a little bit of work here. Hmm. I might just be... be annoying. I'll throw up the nest ball. I'm trying to think right now. What can we do? We could get the... get the Orongaru. That would be helpful right now. Let's instruct. Let's get another card in the hand. Let's nest ball again, and let's go. Let's get that Guzzlord down. And see if we can get, get this working All right now, but we're, we're just super cybolt. God damn it. So, so what's this? Uh, echo, le echo location. If any damage done to this Pokemon by attacks, flip coin of heads prevent that damage. Okay, I see. Heads is a bad thing. We want tails, so it kind of just stalls you out. And then you got the ma the mouth here that says you can use this attack only if you go second, and only on your first turn. Discard an energy attached to one of your opponent's Pokemon. Okay, that's gross. <laughs> Whatever just happened then, that was gross. Um. Okay. Because what does Silent do? Such a deck for three basic energy cards. Yep, okay. I don't know, what can we do here? What, what can we make work? I'm kind of stuck. Kind of, kind of stuck. I 
Actually, we'll just we'll just go for it again. We'll just super cyborg. No. Nah. That's my luck. That's my luck. We'll roll heads again. The time that you don't want to hit heads, you will hit heads. There we go. This this will pretty much just clean everything out all at once. There's literally nothing I can do right now. Ah oh, man. There's there's. I, I don't know. I'm not getting any cards to draw or anything. I've got no other attacks I can use right now. Like I can I can ace roller. I can get Guzzlord back and get a refresh of of the Guzzlord. But like, other than that, I could get. I could get a refresh of the the Hooper. Yeah, I could do that. We'll, we'll get a refresh of the Hooper because then from there I can get I can get the Darkrai up. I guess. See if we can make something something happen with Darkrai before it before it faints. I really don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You've got me. You've got me putting an, into a corner right now, Ferris, and I, I'm not. I'm not really a big fan. This boom, the boom burst attack is doing like so much damage to everything. The only damage isn't like something, something small as well. Okay, so because I can do this, I can throw that on Dark Ride. I can we'll just we'll just sick them all. Field blower doesn't help me. The dark rise don't help me. Nothing really helps me. I needed a wishful bat in there for sure. That needed to be a thing. So here we go. Can I get the knockout? There we go. Alrighty. That ability definitely helps out a lot. But see, Darkrai is already half done now, and you've got a Persian. Persian that could start to put in work. <laughs> Sob. Rip. There, there goes. There goes Noivern. You've already got another one going, so that's a, that's a thing. Welcome back to the stream, Jackaboy. We're just here, chilling, killing. I'm versing Ferris right now. Ferris, that's uh, been in the chat. We're versing, versing Ferris in a viewer battle, and I'm getting destroyed right now. But that is that is a okay. So let's throw that there. Let's throw. Um, I don't even know. Let's throw this on Guz Lord. I really need to get a refresh. So let's get a refresh right now. Yeah. It'll help help Ferris out more than me right now but I'll, I'll take what I can get see if I can make something happen with what I've got but I don't think I can to be honest I don't think I can because we got the wishful bat and we got super rod I don't need either of those right now we'll just dark cleave for knockout there we go there goes there goes Persian and we got a sycamore could probably use that next turn who knows <laughs> Good job, Persian. Alrighty, so Noivern's back out again, which means there's the potential for the, the coin flip stall. That coin flip stall, which is kind of annoying. So let's throw this on, on Guzzlord here. Let's go. So I've got a couple of choices here. I could... I could Sycamore or I could end. I've only got four prizes. I might, I might just sick them all. Right now, I'm just not getting what I need right now. Totally not getting anything, anything that I need right now. But let's go. Actually, yeah, let's throw that on there. Let's throw the EXP share on Guzzlord. And that's pretty much all I can do right now. I could Ultra Ball. Actually, let's Ultra Ball for a. Let's knock that off and throw that into the into the trash. Let's get our little Zoroar out. It's 
So let's throw that up there, and then I can throw... Let's throw the floatstone on Hooper. And let's see. Coin flip. Please don't foul me. Come on, coin flip. Oh, my god. Ah. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Ferris, come on. <laughs> Why, what is your luck when it comes to these coin flips right now? What is your luck? So let's throw that. Let's throw that Zoro Rock up there. Let's Shauna get a fresh hand here. Let's trade. I'm going to get rid of the Zoro Rock right now. I don't think I'll need this Zoro Rock. Who knows? That'll probably backfire later on. Later on, but here. Let's try again. Come on. Oh, man. Oh, my God. Ferris, please. I see. That is my luck. That is my luck, because I know Gold Breaker does extra damage. If the Pokemon is an EX, okay, yeah, it does extra damage, but I'm a GX, so it doesn't affect me. But come on. There we go. We got an energy. That, that's something. That's a win. So let's go... What should we do from here? We can throw another energy on, on Guzzlord, but no, we don't need to. Let's just throw an energy on Zora. Why not? And then from here, I might I might just get a fresh hand. We'll end. I only get the four cards back. Yeah, see, GXs aren't EXs, and a lot of cards in the old meta uh, refer to EXs, and that's exactly what you don't want. That's why Bridget, uh, Bridget is so broken, because it says you can get one EX or three basics, but the GXs being uh, what they are, they're classified as basics. They're not classified as EXs or ultra rares. Which is so, is so broken, and that's why that card goes for like a ridiculous amount of money. The full art Bridget is is money right now. But what can we do here? Let's let's dark cleave, damage decrease, still knockout though. So that's that's all right. I'll take it. See you later, Brody. I had really fun time. Also, love your channel. Can't wait for you. Uh, wait for your, your next vid. No worries, man. I'm glad you can make it out to the stream, George. Um, and I look forward to seeing you in the comment section of one of my next uploads for sure. I'll uh, I'll get onto some video creating later on today, and uh, yeah, it'll be awesome. There'll be some more fresh content on the channel. I love this song. So chill. Okay, so what should we do here? Let's go... <laughs> Let, let's go like this. I, I'm not playing this game. I'm not playing this game. Let's go like that. Let's bring out... Let's bring out Zoro. We ain't playing any games. Let's do Righteous Feeding for Knockout. Let's pick up our next pro. <laughs> don't... No, don't hurt my Muna. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Ferris. It had to be done. It had to be done. And this is where Guzzlord comes into play. This is where Guzzlord can come into play. Hmm. Actually, it doesn't... Oh, we've got the hard charm there. I think my... Is it in here? My field blower is in here. So that... Rip that. Let's let's go like this. Dimension Valley. And throw out the altar of the moon. And then from there, what I can do is I should have a... Fr oh, is it going to cost me two? Or is it going to be free? I think it's free. I should be able to get the free retreat here to Darkrai. And then let's, let's give it again. Give it another hit one more time. Just once. Please. Ferris, I, I swear. If this coin flip fails... I swear. There we go. <laughs> uh, when it counts. When it counts. 
There goes the Nova. Now you've just got the Muna, unless you've got some sort of uh, an amazing plan from here on out. I think uh, I think I'm good. There we go. So we got the the Muna. It says four one. Once during your turn before you before you attack, you may look at the top two cards of your deck, choose one of them, put it into your hand. Okay. So it does a hundred. So from here, I can I can go like this. And does Muna have a resistance? No, it doesn't. Okay. So I could I could knock out with Darkrai, but let's let's retreat into Guzzlord. The munching munching orange himself. And let's use Glutton Glutton GX for the knockout. Man, that Noivern though, Ferris, that Noivern was kind of, kind of scary. It was doing way too much damage. Way too much damage, but that was awesome. I, I appreciate it. That was an awesome battle. Good fun. That was good fun, but yeah, that Noivern though. Yeah, see, if... If EX and... EXs and GXs were the same thing, that, uh, that combination of the Noivern and the... Uh, what is it? The bull. What is it called? What is the bull called? I have to figure. I have to figure this out right now. What is the name of the bull? What is it? Buffalant. That's the one. <laughs> I had to actually had to Google it. I was totally just like having the biggest mind blank just then. But yeah, Buffalant. That was the one. Alrighty, creeping fruit wants to have a battle. Let's 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 give the munching, munching on energies. Another hit here. Let's see see what we can do. Let's uh let's quickly just tweet tweet out the stream to the fam on Twitter. Live doing viewer battles. Come hang. There we go. Let's go like that. Excuse me. Excuse me while I quickly just tweet that out. But uh, what's going on in the, in the chat here? Let's go. Let's go. No. Hey Brody, what did you think about battle? I felt I was doing pretty good. I don't think you're doing too bad. To to be honest. Uh, I wish I could, like, I, I focus a lot more when I'm not streaming uh, on the battles, so I feel as if if we battled off stream, I would be able to have more of a grasp as to, like, how good or bad you, you were doing to give you some some honest feedback. But I, I'd say just in general, I think I think you did pretty good, for sure. Just as a bit of positive feedback. But you have to go, nice stream, looking forward to more of your contents and stream. See you later. Thanks for hanging out in the stream, uh, Luis Santos. Always a pleasure hanging out with you here. Uh, on on the channel as well in the comment section and in and in the streams as well uh, Yeah, I used to wreck people with that deck uh, With that move, but it doesn't work with GX's. Yeah, it's a little bit out of date You'll have to have to update Ferris have to get an updated deck going and then we can have a rematch for sure I'm sure you could put in the work Put in the finest of work and and wreck me. I Know you can do it but Let's go like this Let's nest ball Let's get a Zerua. Um, I'm, I'm updating and opening cards now. Awesome. Definitely sussed out the trades as well. I noticed yesterday that uh, trades were coming through for me. The trades were coming through. But let's go. Let's Lily because we can get eight cards here. Lots of cards in the hand. But let's, let's throw this on Hooper. Okay, so let's let's focus on this battle here, and let's see, let's see if we can give Creeping Fruit a run for his money. Looks like he's running the Bo the Bulu, maybe the Bulu theme deck. Not too too sure. I <laughs> got a got a love heart. I'll send the love send the love back. Why not? Okay, so what what can we do here, guys? Let's go. Let's throw this down. But then we can evolve this one. 
we can throw this on Hooper. Then let's N. Let's get a fresh hand. And then what do we want to do from here? We want to, let's trade. Get rid of Darkrai. See you later, Darkrai. Love you long time, but it's your time to chill. Got nothing in there right now, but that's okay. Let's go. Hmm. What I could do actually is, uh, no, nah, actually, we'll just, we'll just leave it at that for now. We'll just chill. Take it easy. Is it? We've got like a love heart war going on here. Creepy fruit. Creeping fruit, sorry. Bit of a love heart war. I'll win. There you go. I broke the chain. Two hearts back to back. GG. Round one goes to me. Not getting the best draws right now, Creeping Fruit. That's unfortunate. Dylan's unboxing Toy Show. Welcome to the stream. Glad you could make it out. Anyone that's new to the stream right now, we're just kind of chilling, killing here, doing some viewer viewer battles and kind of just going between opening up a couple of packs here and there. And yeah, just kind of floating backwards and forwards. It's all good times. Alrighty. So the Vicar Vault's getting set up real quick. Uh, once during your turn, before you attack, you may search your deck for a Grass Energy and attach a Lightning Energy card from... Um, and attach them to your Pokemon in any way you like, then shuffle your deck. Okay. I see. So let's go, let's throw this on. Oh, actually, no. We could start start putting in work with Hooper right now. And let's get Dark. I actually, I don't want Dark right yet. I don't want Dark right yet. I don't, I don't need Marlow right now. Let's throw Oronguru down, then... What do I want to do from here? What do I want to do from here? I don't really need to do anything else all too, too much. We can just Super Cybolt for knockout there. Get some prizes, some prize movement going. Alrighty. So we got the Vicar Vault going on here. Brody's teaching us how to play Pokemon. I, I'm teaching myself how to play Pokemon right now, Falcon. I'm totally just teaching myself. It's so much more complex than what, what you'd think. Because you could start to get an idea of what you're doing. They just they play an end, all of a sudden your hand just gets like refreshed, and all of a sudden you don't know what is what is going on. It's totally about just kind of keeping your opponent confused and on their toes by just uh, moving through cards quickly, not allowing people enough time to know what's in your discard pile to know what you're gonna do next. But there we go. So that that's a foul. That's a foul on my part there. I lost the wishful baton, which is unfortunate. Which means I do lose those three energies, which puts me in a little bit of a, a bad situation here. Because what do I need to do? I'm going to Field Blower. I'm going to get rid of the Float Stone because that could be a problem. I'm going to give this to Zorok. I'm going to Float Stone Zorok. Then... I think... I think I'm going to Sycamore. I'll get a fresh hand and see if I can see if I can make something work from here. So we've got, got another... Another Zorok there. Can't seem to get my hands on on the Guzzlord yet. I can't seem to can't seem to make that work. But let's just go. Let's trade. I'll get rid of the EXP share. It's too late for the EXP share to come in come in handy at this point. There, there's the there's the Guzzlord there. Let's max Elixir. Let's grab grab an energy. Throw it on Guzzlord. Then let's go Darkrai. Let's let's restoration. Let's let's come back from the dead here. Bam. Let's throw that on you. 
And then we can we can righteous beating here for a, a, a little bit of damage. Not knockout, but but a little bit of damage. Is this the longest stream? It's probably the longest stream that I've done on the channel so far, yeah. Definitely just like chilling, chilling, killing. And and when I'm when I get in this zone, I can sit here for hours and hours. But I'm gonna have to look into wrapping up the stream sometime soon. It's nearly one o'clock in the afternoon. I'm gonna have to look into uh grabbing some grabbing some lunch and possibly creating some more content for the channel too. No spoilers as to what it's gonna be. Well, rip. Nature's judgment. Dang. Alrighty, well, well then, apparently, apparently I'm getting destroyed right now. Let's throw it on, Guzzlord. Yeah, done, and yeah, on Guzzlord, there we go. Okay, so what do I do from here? That is the real question. I'm going to throw Zoroark out again. Let's throw, throw the altar down for now. What can we do? We can nest ball. What can we nest ball for? Hooper? Yeah. Let's get Hooper out. Can definitely shut down all of the GXs though. <clears throat> so, I could N, I can Sycamore, or I could Shauna. I got three different types of, of ways to draw here. I think I'll just benefit myself. I'll Shauna. Right now. Oh, and then I've got the Zoroark as well. So this is perfect. So I can trade. I can Darkrai. I can Max Alexa. Nothing. Couldn't get any energies apparently. That's unfortunate. But then as well, what I can do is I can revive from the dead. My boy's coming back. And then from here I can I can stack on Guzzlord. And then we'll just we'll just do a righteous beating for 120. Not knockout once again, but it's something. It's definitely something. Yeah, my like my max elixir luck is terrible. I how many have I played so far? I've played well, I think I've played two. And one just got discarded, but I can't hit max elixirs. It just isn't possible. I've got lots of energy in the deck. I just don't I just can't hit. Just can't hit him. It's just my luck. It's like coin my coin flip luck just before just before with uh Ferris. My coin flip luck is terrible. Before coming here I just done a two hour stream. Oh really Falcon? So you're just like recovering from your stream by coming to the stream with the Brody Amity of the TCG. Come to hang out and chill. Yeah, that coin flip. <laughs> that coin flip though. Oh, that's a gross hand. I, don't, I really don't need any of the Ultra Balls right now. Good thing I got the end. can get that refresh though. Energy recycle, I got those five energies. Five basic energies, yeah, five basic energies. Brody, do I, do you want codes? Like I'm not, I'm not down to decline codes if you're offering, but at the same time, it, they, they are yours and they should remain yours. In, in my opinion, you should definitely redeem them. It's all good times. You should uh, crack into the packs. But if you, if you do want to give me the codes, you can just uh, send them to me through social media and I'll redeem those uh, after the stream for sure. So let's go. Hmm. Let's just keep stacking here. Do, 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 do. Um, let's let's end. Get a fresh hand. What can I do from here? What can I do to really, really throw throw you for a loop here? Let's let's throw that on Darkrai. Let's go like this. This will be funny. So let's replace my own my own stadium card and let's change things up. Now you gotta get rid of two two of your bench. Who are you gonna get rid of? That's the question. Both Lele's? Okay. Okay, I see you. I can do that too. 
<laughs> I can get rid of my Lele too. We'll, we'll go Lele this. Yo, Soup, what's poppin', dude? Welcome to the stream. I, I'll I'll mod you real quick. Definitely modding friends sh straight away, especially YouTubing friends. You have the power now, my friend. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the hangout. We're here, just like I'm just doing my thing. I'm just doing my thing, trying to make make good of a bad situation here. Um, let's let's get rid of Guzma right now. I know I've got a couple couple more Guzmas in the deck right now, so we should be sweet. God damn it, those those damn Ultra Balls. Leave me an, <laughs> leave me alone. I don't need you right now. Uh, we'll just righteous beating here. That'll do. We'll do a little bit of chip chip damage here. So both Bulus both have 120. So at this point, it it could get dangerous. <laughs> Thank you. Don't give you responsibilities. It, it's it's up to you. See, with with great power comes great responsibility. But at the same time, if you don't acknowledge that you have responsibility or the power, then there is no responsibility because you don't know that you have it. So there you go. There's the workaround. The Ultra Walls do have it out for me right now. And it's a problem. It is a big problem. So the question is, the question is, what I could do right now is I can put in, I can try my luck here. So I put out the Guzzlord. And this is where I try my luck. I go, okay, bad hand. I can draw five cards with an N or I can Sycamore and get rid of all this. So less Sycamore, no more Ultra Balls. See you later. Energy. Energy. There we go. Okay, so so we got an energy. From there, what I can do is this. I can trade. I can get rid of my Darkrai. I can bring back Darkrai from the Deid. Throw an energy on it as well. We can also max Elixir. Why not? We'll give it a hit. There's no cards in my deck. Lol. I didn't even realize this is like my last turn. I just got decked out. <laughs> I just got decked out. What the heck? Uh, we'll just, uh, I guess, I don't know. What can we do? We can just tyrannical hole for knockout. There's nothing else I can do. No. That sucks. We dragged it out for too long. We dragged it out for too long and I, I lost track of my deck. RIP! <laughs> no! Anyways, anyways. There she goes. So let's throw that on Darkrai. No cards in the deck. Ah, that's unfortunate. We're literally one turn. One turn away from winning that just then. Because we could have taken that knockout. We could have got Guzzlord back out. We could have used Glutton GX and got four four prize cards for knocking out the Tapu Bulu that was in play. Ah, no, that sucks. That was an awesome, that was a pretty, pretty good match. I'll, I'll take it. That was pretty solid. That was pretty solid. But let's, let's accept this friend request. I don't know who this is, but yeah. Let me know who that is in the chat. Type type that username that I just added. I think it was like that one there. Ono Loco one. Type that into the chat and let me know who that is, because I have no clue who that is. I just added you. So what's Soup saying? I'm still confused why I don't have the ch channel sponsorship button. It's it, it still says it's ineligible for me. That's interesting. I, I got my first sponsor today. It was actually um, Nerd Australia Gamer, which is kind of awesome. Kind of awesome. But um, I don't know how to enable it. I don't know if it was just because I I did it early. I had it enabled really early. That's so weird. Might have to look that up, actually. I'll do some research for you after the stream, so I'll add it to my, my little list of things to look into. I'm kind of interested, just in case I happen to lose the sponsorship button as well. Sponsor. I'll want to know how to get that re-enabled for sure. 
Yeah, because you need to go into you need to go into your channel, and then you go to uh, where it has everything where it says what's enabled on your channel, and then from there you can actually manually enable it. And if you don't do that, then it just stays to the default of being disabled. Let me know if that works. It, like what that's what Ferris is saying right now. In your um, if you go into where your dashboard is, and then you go to channel, it should be in there somewhere. It'll say something about sponsor. Both in it, you and Pokemon and wife. Why is that? Yeah, I'll look into it for you guys, and I'll let you let you guys know on Twitter for sure, or on Facebook. I'll message you guys. I'll have a look. But yeah, let's open up open up some packs. Why well, we got uh, got the fam here? Let's crack into some packs and see see what's doing. Let's see what we can do. Alrighty, what do we have? Let me know in the chat, guys. What should we crack into right now? We're here. Here's the uh. Here's the little dashboard of packs. What what set should we crack into? I do need to eat some lunch. I do. What do I have? I've got lots of sweets though, guys. Check out this. <laughs> right next to me. I got like this massive bag here. The green screen kind of like destroys it, but I got this massive bag of like trolley lollies, which I'm totally gonna eat later on today. While recording. That's gonna be a thing. Just be munching on all of all of the sweets. Yeah, Ferris, I have so many packs, hey. It's ridiculous ridiculous and that's with me giving out a lot of packs as well my tcg name soup it is amity tcg so it's pretty pretty standard i'll just drop it in the chat there for you legendary treasures everyone wants me to open legendary treasures man i've had so many like requests for people to trade for my legendary treasures packs as well it's like no they're precious <laughs> leave the poor legendary treasures alone Some OG packs. Alrighty, I'll open up a couple of like old packs here. I'll open up a couple of old packs here. Let's see, we got soups. Is this soups friend request right now coming through? Let's go request. TMC Wisp. Whis Who's that? Let me know in the chat. <laughs> Who's that? I'm, I'm gonna add you, it's, it's sweet. We've, we've definitely got uh, room on the friends list. For sure. That's you, Soup? Alrighty, too easy. Too easy. Alrighty, so we've got Plasma Freeze. People don't want to see Shining Legends. See, that seems to be the phase. we got Legendary Treasures, Shining Legends, and then you got like the OG packs, like Plasma Freeze, Next Destinies, like all of the OGs. Nothing but legendary treasures has been tagged for trade. Oh, is that right? Is that what that little heart means? So I take that away. Okay, I see you. I see you. I'm learning. Why did, why did I tag that for trade? I must have had like a misclick somewhere. I could tag like... I don't know. Let's, let's tag some of this stuff here. You've tagged this item as wanted. This will tell other players that you're willing to trade other items for it. Okay, I see. So, I tag it to let people know that's what I want. Okay, I see you. So, what I, what packs do I want? I don't know. Nothing. Nothing, to be honest. I think I'm pretty set for packs right now. Favorite soup is loaded potato soup. So good. <laughs> I like myself a little bit of chicken soup. Chicken and ham. Uh, no, pea and ham. Pea and ham soup is the best. Pea and ham. Let's be real. But let's go into a... Um, actually, let's open some packs. I said I was going to open some packs, so let's do it. Let's do some Plasma Blast. This is the very first set that I got a master set of as well. Fun facts, guys. Pea and ham. Pea and ham soup, you heard correctly. Pea and ham soup is amazing. You just noticed that your sponsorship is enabled? Yeah. I don't know. I don't understand why it's not enabled for soup in Pokemon and Wife. That's so weird. I'm definitely going to suss that out and see, see what's going on. It might have something to do with your YouTube network, maybe. Might have to look into that soup. That may be a thing. I don't know, because I know certain YouTube networks don't allow you to 
receive donations through your channel as well. Like for example, the one that I'm with, I'm with Curse. They don't allow you to get donations directly through your channel, but you can through live streams and stuff like that. But yeah, so Plasma Blast first pack, nothing all too fancy here. We do have Iris. What does Iris do? I remember this card uh, having a gorgeous full art in this set. Uh, during this turn, your Pokemon's attacks do 10 more damage to the active Pokemon for each prize card your opponent has taken. I guess that's like okay. That's okay. Let's play the... Uh, let's play something a little bit more upbeat here. This is like really sad. What's this? Undelatown remix from Black and White. Glitch has like the best remixes though. Let's go like this. You're not in a network. See, that might be a thing. I don't know if being in a network, they enable it for you somehow. I don't know, that's weird. But Falcon doesn't have a network either, so I guess it, it yeah, that doesn't make sense. All right, let's open up another one. Okay, we got a Mesper Hollow there. Sorry, I'm just kind of reading the chat right now. Strike Ninja says, Brody to tag for trade. You tag the arrow that goes two ways and to tag as wanted, you tag the heart. Okay, I see you. I got you. That makes sense. So if I go, for example, to trade, I could go Crimson or Invasion Packs. I go like that. That means that it's up for trade and people can trade for this item. But then if I want it as well, I could I could click the heart. So for example, if I want, what, what sets do I want, for example? I could go like this, and I could throw a heart on like some OG packs, and then hope for that glorious, like sweet deal. Where you can, um, where someone just offers, offers you like the best, the best trade ever, and you can't, you can't, can't deny it. But let's open up a Plasma Storm pack while we're here. Let's do it. Let's see if we can get something amazing out of Plasma Storm here. Where am I graving the music from? What, what's that supposed to mean, Falcon? I mean, is it, are, are these songs just so OG that they're just like coming back alive from the grave? But these are like play, just a playlist, a stream playlist of uh, a couple of different artists. You've got like Mewmore, you've got Glitch X City, you've got, um, I can't even remember. They're in the descriptions of like all of my uploads. I always uh, have links to the, the people that I get music from in my latest uploads. But we're going to Verbank City here. Awesome pull right there. That's my very first one here on TCGO. Then we've got a Reverse Holy Rail over Galate. It's got 140 HP with Powerful Storm that for two colorless, it does 20 times damage. It does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to all of your Pokemon. That's not bad. Not bad, but it is stage two. And you got Swift Lunge. It does 80. Your opponent switches the defending Pokemon with one of his or her benched Pokemon. Okay. And what do we have? Just the vanilla deluxe. That vanilla deluxe though. Yeah, the OG songs, the OG glitch remixes though. This one's the Johto Game Corner remix right now. Throwback as. Throwback as. Okay, so let's go into a go into another pack here. I want that Ultra Ball. Can it? Can I please get like something amazing right now from Sun and Moon Base? Just like a crazy, crazy Ultra Ball. I don't have any. Like, I've never pulled an Ultra Ball. It'll be an Amity first to get one. So we got a Reverse Holy Rare of a Dragonite and just a Beware regular rare. Welcome, C Mac Pride, uh, Prime, Pride, sorry, one to the stream. Thanks for coming and hanging out. I can't even speak right now. Let's have a let's have a drink of this high quality H two O. Yeah, we'll definitely look into look into why um, that sponsor button isn't working for you after the stream. I'll give it a sauce while I'm having some lunch. But yeah, we'll crack into a, a couple of packs here, and then I think we'll wrap up today's stream. I'm I'm definitely starting to get get a bit peckish here, but we've got the butterfree regular right there. I think we'll call it a day there, guys. I'm definitely getting peckish right now. So, shout outs to everyone that came and hang out in today's stream. You guys are the real MVPs. 
Brody, I just sent you some codes through, through Instagram. No worries. I'll definitely suss that out after the stream for sure. I'll go I'll go through all of the social media and I'll, I'll respond to all of you guys as well. i got got a lot to do after the stream. But yeah, thanks. Thanks for hanging out, everyone. I've had a good time today. We've had a powerful... How long have we been streaming for? A powerful three and a half, nearly a four hour stream. And we've we maintain about 20 viewers for the whole time so shout outs to all of you guys you imagine that that's like a school classroom just kind of chilling here watching me play play some tcgo you guys are insane thank you so much i've enjoyed today's stream hopefully you guys have if you guys did make sure you guys drop a like down below on the stream show your support on today's live stream and i look forward to seeing you guys in the next stream or another one of my pokemon trading card game openings thanks for watching guys peace